his start And after he's been hooked, I'll play the one that's on his heart now I gotta listen to regular. I haven't even listened to regular poker face. Hold up. They do in Texas, please. Hey. Fold them, let them hit me, raise it, baby, stay with me. I love it. Love game intuition. Oh, see, that's so ass. Oh, that's so ass. Oh, it's so ass. It's so much worse than the Eric Cartman one. How the fuck is the Eric Cartman version better? What the fuck? Why are the alert boxes going off? Hello, everybody! Flooding in! I'm late as shit, okay? I have a reasoning as to why I'm late this time, dickheads, okay? I was looking into, um, charities for the Turkey and Syria earthquake, uh, because I want to make a TikTok promoting, like, a charity link, uh, because I see a lot of action on it on Twitch, but not that many people. What do you mean cap? What do you mean cap, dickheads? I, yo, what do you mean cap? Turn the lava lamp on. Yo, I'm about to ratio the shit off. Yo, I'm about to ratio the shit out of y'all. Yo, my mods can testify for me. I was looking at savethechildren.org for fucking Turkey and Syria because I'm genuine. Motherfucker saying cap. Motherfucker saying cap, but go fuck yourself. Anyways, it's not true. He's lying. Bro, I was dead ass looking at this site. I lit oh. I literally have this shit up. I literally have this shit up. Now you're gaslighting me. Manifest is gaslighting me. Fuck you. Anyways, I'm gonna probably try and promote that. Uh if it's a good one. I wanna promote a good charity because I know there's a lot of charities. Some are good, some are bad. Um, just to like have some help. Because I know Hassan's got like kind of the Twitch end covered. He's donated, he already has like $1.2 million raised. I'm kind of more of a TikTok realm. Like, I have more influence there than here, comparable to him. Uh, so I want to do some sort of video to where I could promote that. But that's a dub for that because I do want to actually uh, promote that charity. Because uh, I, I know I do a lot of charity shit on Twitch, like charity stream based stuff, but I want to get more into like TikTok charity too, to where I can promote things. Anyways, what are we doing today? We're playing movie games today, chat. Woo! Woo! I can't even fucking, I can't even do a fucking high-pitched scream because my voice cuts out. Woo! What is that? Is that, a, is that another, is that another charity? Can you send that in the disc, can you send that to me on Discord, uh, Crucible? Because I'll compare the two and just, because I obviously can't, like, fucking promo, like, 20 different charities in a TikTok, but I want to, I could maybe promote one or two. Anyways, um... We're playing movie games today, chat. Now, you might be asking yourself, Joe Bart, what the fuck is a movie game? Well, it's an FMV game. That means full motion video. What that means is it's not, uh, like, animated. It's genuinely filmed. It's basically a movie. Somebody redeemed Flex. It's basically a movie where there's a bunch of options. And we choose a lot of the things that go on, and that changes the ending. It changes how the story goes. Now, the reason we're in just chatting currently is because I have two options for you guys to choose from. We might be able to do both today. Very unlikely, though, seeing that I pause all the fucking time, and these games take an hour and a half, two hours, because they're literally a full-length movie. Are you guys ready for me to read the descriptions and you guys are going to choose? Yes or no? Stop typing one when you don't even know what one... Don't... You're already answering... You're already answering which one you want me to play, and I haven't even read the fucking descriptions. Number one could be the worst game I've ever fucking... I could literally read you the shittiest fucking script for a game you've ever heard. Why are pe... Y'all are pissing me off. Big Daddy for the sub fuck for the thousand biddies. I wasn't able to be there, but GG on 21. Dub, can't wait for the Drunk Joe streams. Those will be coming soon. Uh, gonna be doing one with JoJo, Zussi, a bunch of shit. Love, the Luke for the sub, Red Rocker for the sub, DJ for the fringe biddies. 
Don't read this out loud. Don't say the N-word in my chat. 120 for the sub. Hayden and Miles for the sub. Bella for the sub. J-Dog for the 300 bits. Deep Thoughts Thursday. Whenever somebody talks uh, about you breathing, you will manually start to breathe. Yeah. It's the same thing with blinking. God damn it. Why did you fucking... Why the hell did you fucking mention that? Now I'm thinking... Yo, now I'm thinking about that shit. Boba and Josh for the sub, a.k.a. for the 2,000 biddies. I made a TikTok on you and it only got two likes. Damn. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. Elemental for the 300 biddies says, thoughts on Star Wars. It's good. I haven't really watched, like, most of the Star Wars movies, though. Lil Vicky and Lasuli for the sub, Whiplash, and Lil Nate for the sub. I need to get time out of my day to, like, sit down and watch them. Dizzy, SpongeBob, or SpongeBoy, East, and Beef for the sub. All right. Can I read the descriptions of the games now? Mead, Christian for the sub, Mullet for the five inch biddies. You mind saying happy one year, Mar Maria and Elijah? Definitely saying that. Am I saying that right? Happy one year, Maria and Elijah. I think I'm saying that right. Maria or Maria? Venom for the sub, both for the three inch biddies. Are you going to play Hogwarts Legacy? Please, for the love of God, can motherfuckers stop asking me if I'm playing Hogwarts Legacy? Oh my God. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let me give you Hogwarts Legacy right here. Holy fucking shit. Hogwarts intro song. All right. Now we never need to play Hogwarts Legacy for the rest of my life. Good shit. All right, fantastic. Anyways, anyways, let's get into the fucking FMV games here today. Because uh, I'm not playing a 45-hour fucking Harry Potter game. I watched Zeusy play that shit. The amount of filler in that fucking game is insane. Uh, BB for the sub. Barbecue boy. What's up, bro? Think of it a thousand biddies. Bits are my new thing now. Joe Bart Keck you. From now on, I'll only post famous movie quotes. And try my best to keep them short, I promise. Damn, so we'll be able to get the the insider look at what Barbecue Boy's favorite movies are. And the and the best quotes. Dude, that'll actually be it. That's a good idea. Famous movie quotes. NG for the sub, Ryan for the sub. And Barbecue Boy, thank you for the thousand biddies. All right. First FMB game. Everybody sh everybody lock in. Everybody type lock in because I need to fucking read these games to you guys so you can pick one. Okay? <clears throat> Number one is called The Complex. Okay? Here's the descriptive. After a major bioweapon attack on London, oh, there's British people, two scientists find themselves in, I'm joking, for the British people about to get really angry, two scientists find themselves in a locked down laboratory with time and air running out. The Complex is an interactive sci-fi thriller movie where your decisions lead to one of eight suspenseful endings. Number two. Five Dates. Five Dates is an interactive rom-com about the under unpredictable world of digital dating. With five potential female matches, Vinny explores whether compatibility, chemistry, and connection is, it, is still possible in a world where physical touch is no longer an option. Yeah, I knew y'all were going to pick one. Yo, no, motherfucker's about to pick two because it's a Riz game. Nah, bro, come on. The Complex, yo, we'll play both eventually, by the way, but, like, y'all gotta pick one for today. Which? One or two? The Complex, Apocalyptic Scenario, Lockdown, blah, 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 Air Running Out, Sci-Fi Thriller. Two, Rom-Com. Mm. But it's a funny Rom-Com. It won't be a funny Rom-Com. I'll make it funny, though. Uh, Dripsy for the sub, that Black Eye Joe for the sub, Don Quixote for the sub, Bobat for the Thringe Betties. Joseph Bartolozzi, hope you're doing well on this Divine Thursday. I'm opening a coconut to quench my thirst. Also, for the guy that only got two likes on TikTok, you're opening, Bobat, you're opening a coconut. You have a, co how did you obtain a coconut? Keep being consistent. Eventually, you'll begin to grow. Don't uh, let that discourage you. Facts. Kale for the 300 biddies. Have you lost muscle mass? I noticed it when you stood up.
Does it look like I've lost muscle mass? See, what do you mean the store, dickhead? Where do you buy a coconut from the store? You're, you're saying, oh, you buy a coconut from the store. When the fuck have you ever gone to a Walmart and sitting on the aisles of fucking hairy-ass coconut? Get the fuck out of here. Where do you live, Hawaii? Dickhead, I live in New Jersey. They ain't got no damn coconuts in fucking New Jersey. Sorry, and I, I don't live in Orlando, Florida, fuckhead. Ryan for the sub. DJ for the 300 bitties. You weren't supposed to reference it out loud at all. Now my question sounded more crazy than it really was. Bro, it, no, nobody thinks you're crazy in my chat. I'm just saying no. Yes. I, okay, well, now I can't reference it because you don't want me to reference it. Fuck. But no, don't say that in my chat. I know you're allowed to, but I'm saying, like, in my chat, you're not allowed to. Okay, Caleb for the 300 bitties. No, I have not lost muscle mass. Dripsy and Vibe for the sub from, like, a year ago I have, but not now. AKA for the Forge Bitties. I'm going broke because of you. You don't need to give bets. Matt for the sub. All right, y'all want to play the Complex? Is that good? For the people that have voted five dates, do not worry. We will play that game another day. Uh, but it seems like chat wants to go the sci-fi route today rather than, like, a Riz game. Uh, so we're going to do that. Does that sound good, chat? Yes or no? Matt for the sub. RC for the 300 bets. Please start a charity for me so I can afford to live. I'm hungry. Bo for the 300 bets. What? There is going to be four more Dark Pictures games. One about a Yeti. One about a Yeti? Bro, that'll be so fire. One about aliens. How is there a trailer for all of them? Can you send the trailers in the video suggestion tab? I will watch those. Uh, either on Friday or, or not Sunday. Monday. Because Sunday I won't be live. Monday will be your react day. Jonah for the sub. Matt for the sub. Barbecue boy for the 5,000 biddies. Just when I thought I was out, they pulled me back in, Michael Corleone. What movie is that from? I've heard that quote before. That's from The Sopranos. Yeah, it's from... The, wait, is that from The Sopranos? No, it's from The Godfather. The Godfather Part 3. Damn, I gotta watch... I feel like I have seen that. I've definitely seen, I've definitely seen at least part of that movie. Match for the sub. Yo, W fucking quote and W biddies for barbecue boy. Chris for the 300 biddies. I used to live in New York and there were coconuts right there on the produce section. Well, that's New York. Okay, New Jersey is a whole different story. Team all for the 500 biddies. Where did you get that chain from? Um, a jewelry store. All right, let's get into the fucking game. Okay, everybody lock in. We're about to play the complex. And Barbecue Boy, thank you again, bro, for the fucking 5,000 biddies. And W quote, Grace for the sub, Timo for the 1,500 biddies. Thanks for letting me know. I'll make sure I never shop. What do you mean I ma I'll make sure I never shop? What? Crunchy for the, for the sub. All right. The complex. I got to change the fucking, I got to change the stream game. This is definitely the wrong game. <laughs> Wait, the comp? Why does it look different? Yo, is, am I in the right game category, chat? Damn, look at this fucking vibey-ass music. Turn that shit the fuck down. The hell? Where the hell is music volume? Why do none of these games have music volume? I swear to fuck, they only have regular volume, so I gotta fucking mute that shit. Pause choices. Do we want pause choices on? I would vote yes, so we have time to choose. Pause choices on. Display mode, subtitle size, that's all fine. Volume up. All right, deal with the music being loud as shit for fucking two seconds. Did you know Darman's getting canceled? Yeah, we talked about that yesterday on the Minecraft stream. All right, hold up. I got to pause. Do we crack a G Fuel for this stream? Haven't had a G Fuel in the last few streams. Zyra for the sub. Net, uh, knee for the 300 bets. Do you do the sidewalk rule whenever you walk with Brooke? What, that you don't walk on the... Are you saying the sidewalk rule where I walk next to the road? Yes. Uh, if you're talking about where I don't walk on cracks, no. 
<laughs> I don't know what rule you're talking about. Arsenal for the 300 bets. At the gym, currently about to have cardiac arrest because I'm out of G Fuel. If only I could buy G Fuel with 20% off. Bro, how can I help you? Exclamation point G Fuel, code Joe B. 20% off. Yo, bro, motherfucker saying hit a blinker. Buddy, 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 I'm not going to get high every day. I'm not, where's the channel redemption for a blinker? Nowhere, because it's not a fucking high day. It's a goddamn Thursday, buddy. I'm playing a movie game. I'm not getting fucking toasted on a goddamn movie game Thursday, okay? I don't want to. If somebody else wants to, that's your own fucking decision. I don't care, right? I don't want to. Movie game then Val, depending on when we finish this, possibly, yes. Simply for the sub, Val for the sub, or Vale for the sub, garbage for the 300 betties. There's a 17-year-old in my math class, and she's a student teacher. Should I riz her up? And then in parentheses, he says, I'm 15. <sighs> How is she a student teacher if she's 17? What is she, a fucking childhood genius? The hell is she in college? What? Blue bomb. Blue bomber slushy today, chat. Rate it. Rate it. Blue bomber slushy Mega Man today. Fuck. That's probably gonna fucking... Yo, I'll make sure not to spill this G Fuel on my table this time. Also, chat, call me a gremlin. I didn't wash my mat. When I spilled this shit on my PC, Matt, didn't wash it. I sprayed Windex on it. I sprayed Windex on that shit. The fucking window, that's grimy as hell. I ain't give a fuck. I sprayed window cleaner. Yo, y'all want to see my keyboard? <laughs> Yo, why would I even mention this? This shit is disgusting. Hold up. How do I get it? Oh, it doesn't look that bad. <laughs> there it is. Yo, look at that shit. Bro, what is that? What is that? Like, it looks like it looks like dandruff. Clean it? Bro, I'm just gonna wait until it gets unbearable and then throw it out. <laughs> like, I'm not, I'm not. Bro, by the time it doesn't work anymore, I it'll just I'll spill G Fuel on it or some shit. Is it that bad? Bro, it's not as bad as XQC's. Have y'all seen XQC's? Like, mine is like. Bro, it's only it's only this half of the keyboard, too. Look, this half's clean. Why is this half clean and this half's dirty? I think I'm spitting on it. I think that's what it is. I think I've been spitting on my keyboard. Who cares? I'm the only motherfucker that uses it. That's grimy as hell. I don't give a fuck. Now I gotta show XQC's keyboard. Use a duster? It doesn't work, man. XQC's has, like, chunks of hair in it. No, Tyler 1's is the worst. That one's even worse. Have y'all seen Tyler 1's keyboard? <laughs> Bro, that's like a chunk of a Cheeto just sitting in between the page up and the home button. Oh my god, that's actually that's really bad. Like like the, my my worst section looks like his best section. Dude, what is that? That looks like cat hair. Like, he, he has a buzz cut. What is that? Like, what is that? Genuinely. Oh, my God. Bobat for the 25! I'm literally from Jersey. I got it from Walmart. Touch grass. You got a coconut from Walmart. What fucking Walmart sells a fucking hairy coconut? I have never, I have never been to a Walmart that sells a coconut. I got ratioed, bro. Um, okay, okay, we have different Walmarts. Fuck. Xerxes for the sub. Yo, Bobat, thank you for the fucking $25 dono. Amelia for the five gifteds as well. Down in the chat for that too. Thank you for the five gifteds. And Bobat for the 25. Oh, and for the kid asking if he should riz up that person, bro, I don't know. It's up to you. Bo for the 300 bits. I don't know how to send a video to the reactions on uh, reaction recommendations. You just send YouTube links. Crunchy for the five hundred bets. All ladies in the chat. I'm diamond one on rainbow six. Yeah, what Riz is that? Yeah, all ladies in the chat. He's diamond one. He's diamond one in rainbow. All right, let's get into the fucking game. Everybody lock in. Everybody lock in. We're twenty minutes into stream. We haven't even started this shit.
Is it just... Okay, now I'm pausing. I know I just said lock-in, okay? I know I'm contradicting what I just fucking said. Is it just me, or am I taking longer to, like, start whatever the fuck I want to do, like, every stream? I feel like I just talk to you guys more now. Dallas for the 510 bits. Dang boy for the tier 2 sub. It's because you guys gaslight me. I'm blaming my chat. I'm blaming my chat. I'm moving on. Southeast Asia. Squid Games. Oh. <laughs> Bro, that looked exactly like the Squid Games. That looked exactly like the that looked exactly like the Squid Games outfit though. Until that fucking came in. Until that came into fucking full focus, bro, that dead ass looked like the square motherfuckers. Hey, so I've done a full body cleanse on both of them. Space is sterile. How's the audio? Did you get blood samples for Kensington's research project? Mm hmm. Nice work, Dr. Wakefield. So, another drone. Yeah, they fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, no doubt. No doubt. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, bro. I'm I, like that. <coughs> nice one, Dr. Wakefield. Ain't nobody saying that shit. They dropped nerve agent on their apartment block. A woman was coming home from the shops. The boy was playing with a soccer ball. What you mean, uh, a football? No. Oh. He just winked at her. Hi. I'm Amy. You're. Handle. Yo, if motherfuckers are that sick, I'm putting on my fucking gas mask. Buddy's buddy is sweating in a tent. Nope, putting that mask on. I what the fuck? Read my chat real quick. Oh my god, bro. It's gonna be some shit. I are I'm predicting this right now. Two inch is gonna say that he would eat this woman's poop. That is exactly what two inch is gonna say. Speaking of coconut, I still stand by how I would. I'm not even reading that. Y'all have to read that. I'm not reading that. Nope. Bro. So wet, mushy, soft. Getting me all excited? What? 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 What do you mean? What do you mean, bro? When have you ever said that? When have you ever said that? Oh my god, I do not remember you mentioning that you would do that to a coconut. What the fuck? Simply for the fucking 600 biddies, Mr. Andrews for the... Bro, my G Fuel fridge is loud as hell right now. Mr. Andreas for the 300 bets. You missed my previous bets. As I said, you'll be hearing from my lawyers. You made a big mistake, buddy old pal. Uh, bah, 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 hold up. Let me read your other bets. Joe, the other day you refused to father my children, and I'm spiteful. You'll be hearing from my lawyers. I don't have to father your children. Garbage for the 300 bets. She's going to college, but she has to be a student teacher for a bit. She sits next to me. She's fine as hell. She's blonde. I think I might use my thigh crusher munch riz. Thigh crusher munch riz? Dow yeah, let's see how... Let me know how that goes. Dallas for the 510 bits. Hey, Joe, I accidentally forgot to type my message last time. I'm a silent tier 3 sub. Bro, think of the tier 3. If you gave a tier 3 and I didn't notice it. Normally, I just read the subs. I want to let you know I bought MVD Plus on Hypixel. Love your stream VODs. Always working when you go live. Dub. Think of the 500 bitties and think of the fucking tier 3 sub, bro. All right, lock in. Are you going to hurt me? Bitch, I thought they were going to pause. I thought they were going to pause. I have pause choices on. Let's see what happens. Okay, good shit. I was going to say, I was going to say, they really going to run me out here? Fuck. Lighthearted, are you gonna hurt me? Yes. Listen, let me do my work and you'll live. Understand? You might lose a few arms and legs, but. Reese, I need to administer atropine. Damn. What are the odds yeah, of that? I didn't get a chance to restart the vibe. What are the odds of that? Listen to me and you'll live. 
He immediately dies. Damn. Else. Supply tent now. It's okay. Tell him. It's okay. Atropine injections worked on everyone I treated in Syria. Okay? okay. Wow, it's happening to both hey, of them at Here once? What's your name? Dima. We're not safe here. The Supreme Leader ordered this attack. We're here to help you. He's trying to kill us. Both of us are stand against him. Oh. Tell me. Will this chemical ruin my life? Uh, let's be realistic. It's very serious. You're in the best possible hands, I promise. Honesty. It's very nice to hear it for once. Thank you. I need... I need to save my baby. Somebody said he's been smoking those fake carts. Nah. <laughs> Bro's been hitting those Rick and Morty carts in the fucking handicap bathroom too much. Damn. Bro's, Bro's, been, in, Bro's been in third period ripping those Mario carts too much. Shit. Crawl for the sub. Who the fuck did she get a pistol? All the supply tent's been depleted. There's only one pile left. Oh my god, I already have to pick someone to live? Yo, you're fucking kidding me. What are you gonna do? Make a decision. Bro, I gotta save the woman, right? You gotta save the woman. Why is everybody saying Talo? Dima. Bro, I don't know either of them. I had a two-sentence conversation with both of them. What am I gonna shoot the other one? Dima. Dima, give me your arm. Dima, please, you have to trust me. This will save you and your baby. Oh, yeah, she's pregnant. Bro, I just spit all over my keyboard. See, that's why my keyboard's dirty as hell. Hold up. What the fuck? Bro, motherfucker saying ew. Like you're about to be playing some fucking video game on my goddamn keyboard. Fuck out of here. You ain't using my damn keyboard. Uh, I'm the only motherfucker using it. Bro, and then I gotta pause. Hold up. Somebody redeemed Dent. It's not even really dentish today. Key for the $10 fucking dono. First time donating, you heard of Pink Floyd. Yeah. What about him? And Cole for the Forge Bets. Have you seen what happened at Joe's house, Joe Mama? And Key for the 10. Thank you for the fucking 10, Keto. All right, shoot Tallow in the head. Reese, how do I save them both? Reese! Yo, he just dipped. No fucking way he gave me that syringe and skedaddle. What an intro that is. Already got one of them killed. Yikes. Five years later. What fucking city is this? London? Is this what London looks like? No damn way London looks that good. We stand on the precipice of history. I'm Dr. Amy Tennant, and I'm here on behalf of the visionary Natalie Kensington to inform you how your investments have made that possible. Firstly, we've been using your billions for the greater good.
Damn, I already got him dead. Is there a way that I could have saved both of them? The Kensington Corporation's relationship with Kindar has flourished since the resolution of its civil war. Our teams have been working on development projects with some of the country's top scientists. Natalie has even developed an internship program for some of the country's brightest young minds. In fact, some of our Kindarian interns are here with us today. Oh, wee. Is Kindar still a totalitarian state? Human rights violations? Why are you giving people alcohol on a serious meeting? Like, even if it's one glass of champagne, you're at a fucking meeting about, like, saving lives. And you're drinking. All that shit. Engage or dismiss. He's trying to gaslight me right now. He's trying to gaslight me right now. I feel like I have to answer the question. But he's at the but he's at the fucking back of the table too. Must be important. Must be a head backer of this idea. Gotta engage. Kindar is at peace, but your concern is understandable. May I continue my presentation? I'm just saying it's bad PR for us to associate with Kensington. She's dealing with a dictator. Well, as you've seen, that's simply not the case. Why is there so much research happening out there? It's a fucking waste of our money and resources. Kinder is a former. Yo, I'm British telling this bro to shut the we're fuck all here up. trying to help it recover. It seems like good philanthropic PR to me. And it's a tax haven. Damn, they're only doing this for taxes. Good one. Owl people. They don't actually care. Somebody redeem flex. She's sick with something. Why the fuck is she freaking out there? Oh god. Me now, trying to hold in my the vomit. The real reason you're here. The Kensington complex. Damn, are... you are losing muscle. I weigh exactly the same, bro. Bro. I'm lo Did I lose muscle from two years ago? Yeah. I've lost like 10 pounds. I've been the same weight for the last eight months. What the fuck are you talking about? I look exactly the same. You are. Okay. And you're still smaller than me. Good shit. Buddy, try and talk shit on me. You're fucking five, six, and a hundred pounds. Yeah, talk the fucking work. Talk the fucking work. Stop being a little fucking weasel. Stop being a little fucking, stop being a little fucking bridge gremlin. Sitting under the fuck, sitting under the fucking, the little bridge trying to piss me off right now. You're weak as shit. Oh my God, it's all that weed? What do you mean all that weed? Fuck. SL for the three. Nah, y'all are gaslighting me. Garbage for the 300 bits. Crowley for the thousand biddies. I probably actually have lost like two pounds, but that was because I had the stomach virus fucking on my birthday. I ate a hundred calories. Love your streams. You make me, uh, you make a lot of people feel better when they're watching you. Thank you. And Crowley for the 400 biddies. I have not, I have not, uh, Joe is body shaming. I'm not body shaming. Motherfuckers try to diss me. Motherfuckers try to tell me I'm weak when they're probably weaker than me. So don't talk shit. Pissing me off. Anyways. It's Jester for the sub. No, I have lost muscle mass since I was like fucking a senior in high school when I was 18, like two and a half or three years ago. But like, bro, that was when I genuinely took lifting way more seriously. And that's all I did. Who the fuck cares? Cre uh, crispy for the sub, Jack for the sub. All I do is maintain now. Impenetrable HQ of laboratories built bespoke to Natalie's specifications by the world-renowned Parker Kaplani. Deep within the complex is Security Lab Alpha, a womb of scientific advancement. Nah, now like no, 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 It be Lizzie for the sub. Lil Big for the sub. I ain't lose muscle. There, we have something remarkable in development. I'm sure 
all of your news feeds have told you that Gordon Grosvenor's expedition to Mars is becoming a reality. Yes, the first person- They're just trying to make you mad? Oh, I know. That's why I'm locking back in. Everybody lock the fuck in. Everybody shut the fuck up. It was because when I posted that fucking duet on my goddamn birthday, when I did that fucking dance, when I did that fucking dance, and everybody was like, oh, damn, Joe, three years ago you were bigger. Three years ago I filmed that video after I hit a fucking mean-ass full-body lift, and I was swole as shit. That's why. You want my dead-ass You want my dead ass reasoning? I got swole as fuck when I did that fucking video so I would look bigger when I was 18. Now, now I ain't give a fuck how I look anymore. Now I don't care, right? So I just fucking film the video. If I fucking hit a two-hour full-body lift and, and I fucking increase my arm size by two inches so I can film the video, it would be an entirely different story, right? Damn. Yes, I lost like six pounds since then. Most of it was fat. Ain't nobody give a shit anyways. I maintain now. I'm not fucking, I'm not fucking, oh yeah, I need to hit this next full-body max. I need, to, I need to hit this next deadlift max at the gym. Nobody fucking cares. Lock in. I'm getting back into the game. Garbage for the fridge, buddy. Says you missed my bets. Uh, here's how I riz her up. I get on my knees. She's so beautiful. I would let her choke me with her thighs. And I would eat your kidney stones like peanuts. What the fuck? Lock in. ...to set foot on Mars will be British if we can hurdle this final obstacle together. They talking about going on Mars? I gotta zone. I gotta zone back in. Yo, she is shivering. Hey. Ah, damn. Hey. Sweating. Are you okay? Ain't nobody asking yeah, that on the subway. Don't do drugs, okay? We can't fit a hospital on a 10-ton Mars lander. How do we get around this? Nanocells. Somebody said 0 .001 seconds without the za. Bro, the fucking the sophomore high school nicotine addicts, 10 minutes into a class when they haven't hit their fucking wham cannon. Stem cells interwoven with nanotech. Once inside a host, they migrate to the site of injury. There, they regrow bone and generate extra blood to help catalyze the healing process. Tiny magic bullets. What's your problem? I ain't got no problem, dumbass. You're fucking sweating, looking like you're about to vomit. Yeah, give me the figure, dickhead. Looking like a goddamn this chicken. This is, of course, just a mock-up. The real nanocells are still in development and securely back at the complex. But once they're ready, we can begin regulated human trials. Having treated victims of chemical attacks all over the world, I know that nanocells could be miracle tech. <gasps> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> you're not you when you're hungry. I think you need a Snickers. That was a dumbass joke. That was a stupid ass fucking joke. Amy, you need it urgently. Hang on. I have some serious concerns about this. Likewise. Before my employer invests any more capital, she wants some answers. Amy, I really can't wait. We need to get you to the car now. Field more questions or let's go? I really don't care about those two dickheads. They're on the side, right? Motherfuckers that sit on the side table, not important. Motherfuckers that sit on the, on the front and back, that's important, right? Let's go. That lady's puking on the fucking subway. Fuck them. Let's go. It's an emergency. I have to go, but please stay and enjoy the wonderful hospitality. Let's go. And yeah, they could talk another time. I need to get you on the scene immediately. The scene? What happened? 4K dislikes. I'm ruling out food poisoning. She has other alarming symptoms, we've been told. Naturally, everyone's crying terrorism. A suicide bomber with a malfunctioning bioweapon? 
We need to get her to the complex. Okay, why is this our problem? Uh, because she's one of our interns. Somebody said stream is freezing a lot. No, it's not. Is the stream freezing, chat? Yes or no? If it's not, I'm timing this kid out for an hour. And P.S. for the 300 bets. Actually, I won't because it's probably your fucking Wi-Fi. And I don't want to be a dick. TikTok for the sub. Yeah, it's not, it's not fucking lagging. Thank God you're here. This is beyond our remit. Is she dead? Excellent quarantine work. I'll examine her back at the complex. Damn, they gotta put her in that way. fucking thick-ass capsule? And I was right next to that motherfucker? Oh, nah. Oh, nah. What the fuck? Bro, I would be skitting. I'm, yo, chat, you're sitting next to that lady. You're sitting next to that lady. She starts fucking vomiting blood. And then you see her in that capsule. I'd be like, bro, what did she just give me? What the what fucking whack-ass alien disease did I just contract? Before moving her, uh, a single-person drone or ground happiness. The drone will get her there faster. But it's more dangerous. If it crashes, then whatever's inside is she it, dead? To the public. It won't crash. It's Kensington Tech. Use the drone, Amy. Mmm, drum. Drum. Don't fuck it up. That might have been a really bad so, idea. What else do we know about her? Nothing yet. Let's get back to the complex. Chris for the 300 bits says your mods are mean. You missed my bits and I was telling them so you can tell so they could tell you and they got pressed. Like, come on, mods, it was a joke. What do you mean it was a joke? I used to live in NY. There were coconuts right there. I already read that. Do you have any advice for when I have to pee, but I'm busy watching your stream? Just walk to the bathroom. Put me on your on your phone and then walk to the bathroom. You have to pee. Go to the bathroom. Pause the stream. And then Phase Red said, why did you get mad at me? Chill, it froze for me. I get mad because motherfuckers lie and they say that the stream froze or that I'm lagging to try and piss me off. Uh, I thought you were doing that. You really need somebody to pick up your bag and your fucking coat? Bro, that's the dumbest job ever. Like, no one, no one needs that. Hey, can I take your jacket? No, I'll just fucking hold it. I'll put it on the back of my chair. Oh my God. I've never understood that shit at restaurants or anything. It's always some fancy ass shit. I don't need some coat room. I'll just fucking put it around my fucking chair. Buddies of our renegades. Well, the prospect of losing a friend in a strange country, I can empathize with that. Today we need all your field experience, Amy. Time to roll back the ears. Mm -hmm. You can say that again. You've got to be kidding me. Nah. It's been a while, Dr. Wakefield. You got here fast. Well, there weren't any blood vomiting ladies on my tube line. Why is his hair Please wet? Miss Wakefield. Hug. Let's walk and talk. Somebody said just got so, back. Quick this recap. Legend we the media just that the game. Nothing has happened. Well, actually, something. What happened in the game thus far? They're working for a company that works on stem cells as well as a bunch of futur futuristic shit. They're talking about going to Mars, all this other blah, blah, blah. Right? Uh, they're working in this country called Kindar. Some lady just started vomiting blood and they have to deal with it. Boom. Is that is that the recap? Is that the recap? And somebody died. I killed somebody in the first minute. I need to take this. Was it her? Money for the sun. So, do we have a name yet? Claire Mahek, she's one of us. Inside job. Now, she must be acting alone. Why else would she take the tube? 
Well, Uber doesn't offer a getaway car service yet, so... Look, have we considered the hysteria might actually be valid? Well, terrorism... I highly doubt it. Perceptive as ever. Hey, Amy, look. I promise I didn't know you still worked here. If I did, I would have... Stayed away? Yeah, I'm sure. <sighs> nah, do y'all actually deadass think about that shit, though? That, like, there's government... Like, even our government... There's so many, like, countries that have, like, medical warped diseases that they could just release out into the public and it would kill everybody. Like, everyone. Like, they could do that at any time. China, U.S., Russia. Like, we each have, like, probably, like, 45 fucking diseases. Somebody said shut up about the lag. Yeah, it's not lagging. They're just trying to be dickheads. Yo, mods, if anybody says the stream's lagging, just time them out for, like, 10 hours now because they're just trying to be dicks now because I know the stream's not lagging. I don't even know, like, chat, say, okay, say a mass disease gets released out into the United States. Where, where's the first place you're going? I'm locking down, I'm locking down the nearest Walmart. And I'm, I'm, I'm kicking everybody the fuck out. I'm kicking everybody the fuck out. And if they want to stay in the Walmart, I'm ruling that shit with an iron fist. I run that Walmart. I run that Walmart. Motherfuckers are saying states. Oh, yeah, go to, like, yeah, obviously you could go to, like, fucking Wyoming, somewhere in the middle of nowhere. Outside of that, though, go to a Target. Targets don't have that much food. Look. Why are you skydiving or bungee jumping or whatever it is that you were up to? Because I'm passing through London. I checked my Twitter feed this morning, so something I could help with. Plus, Kensington wants my expertise again. Well, she already has my expertise. I'm not disputing that, nor am I apologizing for the skydiving. Guy's got to live. What's happening? I need a recap. Yo, I'm not doing a recap again. I just did a recap two minutes ago. Did you fucking pay attention? Oh, my God. They work for a company that develops fucking medicine, stem cells. They work on a lot of futuristic shit. They're dealing with somebody that might have been, like, uh, a part of some terrorist thing involved in, uh, like, a bioweapon. Like a disease. Boom. That's it. And then if you could come back and let me know your decisions. Okay. Thank you. You didn't want to run this by me? Two lifesavers are better than one. Reese Wakefield is a deserter. I know he's let us down in the past, but people change. Emily did due diligence too. Come on. She talks way too damn quiet. Hey, uh, guys, can I just, uh, have five minutes? Just, uh, just need to use the gents. Five minutes to use the bathroom? You're a dude. Can what, we go, what are you taking please? a shit? Follow Reese, follow Nathalie, Amy's office. Fuck. One, two, or three. Why the hell would I follow bro to the bathroom? That is weird as shit. Not doing that. Follow Nathalie and then Amy's office. Bro, y'all really want me to follow him to the bathroom? Oh my god. Now I'm gonna use the toilet as well. There are toilets down there. Amy! Is she really that pressed that she has to use the fucking bathroom? It takes five minutes. Yo, he's not going to the bathroom, though. Oh, he is. Yo, she really about to go in the men's bathroom? Nah. Nah, look, they're Gender looking at her. toilets. New policy. Cat. What does she think? He's got some secret fucking lair in the bathroom? Why does she want to peep at him taking a shit? What the fuck is going on? Nah, this mad we What is he doing? <laughs> what the fuck? Like buddy had to recuperate. What are you tripping balls or some shit? What the fuck? Somebody, y'all are saying he's high as shit. From your assistant's down in security lab, Alpha. Bro, she's bleeding out of her eye. That you probably hurts so guy. much. Security lab, Alpha. Now 
Nat, is this my tech? Yo, what is with this girl, bro? Yes. But how? I mean, nothing leaves or enters the lab without us knowing about it. Emily and I will get to the bottom of that. You just get the nanocells, otherwise our life's work's gone. All of the nanocells are inside of her? It, it was the master batch. No duplicates were made. Good luck. Wait, I gotta perform surgery on this woman? XV for the sub. Track for the 300 biddies. Track season is here. We need a reaction from your old track videos. No money for the sub. J Dog for the 300 biddies. Just a reminder to keep breathing and blinking. Oh my god. Woo! Oh my god, you guys are serious about your fashion. Yeah, no more frumpy hazmat suits. Pressure suits? You'll see. All right. Yo, he can't, he about to take his pants off. Damn, he didn't even think about that shit. Oh my God. Bro, change in the cubicle, change with Reese. Fuck. Bro, this is mad weird if I change, if I change with him, bro. This mad weird, y'all really just, y'all really type in too. Y'all really spam in too. This about to be TOS. Dude, it, if they're actually about to get butt ass naked, I'll just go full screen. Hold on. Better changing facilities than in the Congo, right? Eh? Yeah. And Kinder. Bro, I got my shit ready on just chatting. Oh my God. Hold up. Oh, his pants are down. Okay, no, they're, they're not naked. They're not naked. Sneak a peek at Reese. What am I, about to stare at his ass? Sneak a peek at Reese, just don't. Nah, he saw her! Nah! Yo, why is his underwear so fucking low-waisted? Jesus Christ. <laughs> But he's got that shit down by the ass crack. What the fuck? What the <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Bro, pull your underwear up. What the fuck? <laughs> barbecue boy, what the fuck? Dub in the chat, barbecue boy for the 5,000 fucking biddies. You had best unfuck yourself or I will unscrew your head and shit down your neck. Gunnery Sergeant Hartman, full metal jacket. You had best unfuck yourself or I will unscrew your head and shit down your neck. Bruh, now I need to watch full metal jackets. <laughs> Bro, thank you for the 5,000 fucking biddies. Damn, disturbing for the $25 dono. I'm back to make sure you get that Chick-fil-A. I'm smacking a spicy chicken sandwich while watching. Do you use the do you have pickles or no pickles? Yo, chat. Pickles or no pickles on a chicken sandwich? No pickles. No pickles. I know motherfuckers are gonna say that's an L. I yo, if I get the pickles, it ruins the sandwich. It ruins the sandwich. It's so it's bro. They don't work well together. I know, motherfucker. Oh, it's good. It's salty. Oh, it, it works well. It works well with a chicken sandwich. It really does. No. Some two, two nasty ass, soggy ass pickles, dude. It doesn't matter what chicken sandwich it is. Popeyes, Chick Fil A, McDonald's, whatever, bro. Fucking, I don't even like pickles, but like, bro, on a fucking chicken sandwich, it makes it even worse. It doesn't. It does not make it better. It's so gross. I want to eat the chicken sandwich for the chicken. The pickles overpowers everything else. And thank you for the $25 dono. And Barbecue Boy, thank you for the fucking 5,000 biddies. That for the sub. And XV for the sub. Bro, thank you, Barbecue Boy. And Disturbing. $25 from uh, Disturbing. And uh, 5,000 biddies from Barbecue Boy. And Disturbing for the three. I get no pickles. Bro, that's what I'm saying. It makes the bun. Yeah, it does. It makes the bun green and soggy. Ugh. No. Not a fan. We're going into space.
the fuck are they getting sprayed Backing with? Conditions active. Something like that. Echo! This vacuum acts as the last line of defense to prevent microbes from escaping the lab. The lack of air makes it sterile as hell. Well, that's great on a microscopic level, but... Sterile? Dumbass? Dumbass alert! Sterile? 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 Dumbass. Dumbass. Who the fuck says that? Barriers. Bro, where are they going? This is like some Star Wars again? shit. Engage or ignore? Oop. One or two, one or two, one or two, one or two. Why are people saying W. Herman? Why is everybody saying hi, Herman? Oh, everybody say hi, Herman. He's my cat and watches Joe. Let me play mouse noises for your cat. Do you think that'll make your cat happy? Yo, his cat's probably freaking the fuck out right now. His cat's probably skitzing. His cat's probably fucking running around and shit. CSAP for the three but he's want to say thanks for the supportive words that helped me to open up to my parents and we uh about me trying to kill myself. Bro, I mean, I'm glad that you reached out to your parents and I'm glad that they're trying to help you now. Uh CSAP genuinely dub for that. Uh I'm glad that you that you reached out to them. I'm glad I could help. WCSAP. All right, I got to stop with this fucking mouse shit. All right, let's get back into the fucking game. All right, what are we doing? Am I engaging him or am I or am I ignoring him? I say we engage. Four years last Wednesday. Yeah. It's been that long. Just thinking about some of the stuff we saw. I saw a whole other year's worth after you left. It wasn't just skydiving. I needed a reset. Try new things. Learn anything that could help us today? Hope not. It's weird as hell how many fucking barriers there are. Ominous as shit. She about to be a zombie in this room. Broke out of the fucking... The green screen's terrible. Yeah, no, that green screen was pretty bad. So the meditation's new. So is the spying. Touche. Vacuum conditions inactive. Bro, they're giving off the vibes that they just had terrible sex. Like that, like that's just, like bro, it's just that, like they are so awkward. Why are they so awkward around each other? They were co-workers. They didn't, they stopped working together. Like, okay, your co-workers, you stopped working together for four years and you're back working together. Like that's not that weird. Like the only reason they're being weird is because they did something weird. Like they were together at some point. And he left her. Bro, why aren't they in hazmat suits? The fuck? Oh, they gonna take these shits off now? The fuck was the point of them wearing them? Dr. Thomas Malkin, Dr. Everly North. This is Dr. Reese Wakefield. He'll be assisting us today. Cool pony cell. Let me take you to- It's a man bun. <sighs> Feels like we're at the center of those dolls that go inside each other. Matryoshka dolls. Yeah. Russian, aren't they? <laughs> so what's your story then, Malkin? I wanted to assist Dr. Tennant since I saw a talk at the Plains Summit about the extracellular matrix and lattice in stem cells. Oh, she's alive. How the fuck is she Holy alive? shit. It's attacking the bone structure. We've never seen anything like it. I have a sample of her blood under the microscope. Uh, 
Guys, this is my tech. You looked at that shit for two seconds. You looked at those fucking blood cells for two seconds. You ain't fucking no. That shit looks just that looks like blood cells. Oh fuck out of Oh, this is my tech. You oh, you saw a little fucking circle? Oh yeah, no, I can tell. Fuck off. You ain't no. The nanocells are inside her. But they're unfinished. There's no off switch, so they're just coursing through her body, producing excess bone and blood. But how could she have contracted them? I don't want to be that guy. Why can't they just kill her and start over? Like, they're doing all of this, but it's her life's work, bro. But they, they know how to do it now. Like, they, yo, yo, her life's work. It's her life's work, and they didn't make a backup. She had like she'd been working on this shit for twenty years. She only had she only had one, and they took it. <laughs> like, they fucking they fucking they make a backup on that shit. From a spillage, maybe. They barely survive for two minutes once they're exposed to air, and she didn't have the authorization to access them. Someone's put them in her. <laughs> No, 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 leave it oh, in there, shit. you it. Oh, oh man, shit! It feels fucking weird. You're a terrorist. <laughs> I'd be a terrible one if I was. I did this for Nina. But he's knocking on it like it's a fish tank. Are you a terrorist? <laughs> Are you here to kill us? But he's knocking on the glass? Why the fuck would she say yes? My God. Barbecue for the sub. Jeremiah for the 300 bitties. Hey, Joe. I don't know what else to do. I have nobody in my life uh, at all. The depression is only getting worse. I have already got a psychologist, but she doesn't help me at all. I'm just ready to end it all, so I wanted to say my final goodbye to a person that has made me happy for over a year. Bro, it, 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 I'm going to give you I'm gonna give you an example on something as to why you don't need to kill yourself. You just said... That I have made you happy for over a year. If there is anything in life that at all brings you joy, why the fuck would you want to leave that, right? Don't kill yourself, right? There is way more to life than you think that there is, okay? I'm not trying to be blunt here, and I understand you're going through something and your depression is getting worse, and that is bad, but... Suicide is literally never the answer, right? Never, never the answer, okay? Um, you're probably young, if I had a guess, because most of my audience is like the ju sophomores, juniors in high school, right? You have way more to live for, right? You're, you're early into your life. Do not commit suicide, please. Like, I'm genuinely, I'm genuinely saying, bro. He said I'm 17. That's you're 17. The average American lives to 75. You got another you got another 60 years, dude. You you haven't even begun your life yet. Why would you end your life before it's even started? Do you know what I mean? Like I understand life is bad right now. You're not even you're not even into the freedom yet. Right? You can do you make your life what you want to do. And I understand Life can be hard, and a lot of people don't want to help you. That is a realization. It is a realization that not that many people are going to be there for you and help you that, that you would think, right? But there are people that care about you. I've seen my best friend die in front of me. My dad hit me because of it. Well, your dad sucks. That doesn't mean you should kill yourself. Dude, living is so statistically unlikely. You have someone, you have someone that cares about you. Don't do it, please. Genuinely, please, okay? Reach out to somebody, talk to somebody. PTSD is way too much for me. I'm not strong enough for life. Yes, you are. You're strong enough for life. Everybody is strong enough for life, okay? Do not kill yourself, right? I understand you're going through something and that does suck, but reach out to somebody, I understand you're already saying you're talking to a psychologist. You could talk to other people. You could start 
finding other ways to work on yourself, right? I understand like you're going to a psychologist, but that's not the only thing that you can do. There's a million things that you can do to work on yourself to have other people help you, right? Push through it. You're young. You're 17. You can do so many things with your life. Yeah, there, life sucks a lot of the time. But life isn't about focusing on the what's shitty, right? A lot of shitty things happen in life. A lot of unpredictable things happen in life that nobody wants to deal with. Some more than others. You've probably gone through a lot more shit than the average 17-year-old. But what I'll say is that shit, when you get through it, will change you for the better. I'll try and push through it today, I guess. No, I need you to push through it every day, not today. When you die, it should be of natural causes. You should never take your own life, okay? This is the same kid who was racist in your Discord towards Asians and said the N-word in chat. Discord mods are saying this is for attention. Well, I don't want to I don't want to say that it's for attention. He said Joe this for real means a lot. Okay. Even if that, even if they did do that shit, you still shouldn't kill yourself, bro. That's not, stop saying L chatter, okay, chat? Even if they did do that whack shit, you shouldn't tell somebody to kill themselves, okay? You shouldn't say L chatter for that. Like, see, like seriously, chat? Now, that's L chat. That's L chat. Whoever the fuck said L chatter, that's being L chat right now. I understand that's fucked if they did that, but still. You shouldn't, you shouldn't be like, okay, and flip flop, right? Just because of that, they shouldn't still, like, it's still, it's still not a, a fucking scenario where they should kill themselves. Like, what? L chat for real. That's not, so like, bro, I don't know if this is attention seeking. I'm going to take it as serious. Jeremiah, I'm hoping that, I'm, I'm hoping that you're not joking. If you're joking, that's fucked up, okay? If you're not joking, do not kill yourself. There is so many more things to live for than you think, okay? You're young. You have your entire life ahead of you. You can learn so many things. You can meet new people. You can travel the world. You can see what life has to offer outside of the shit, okay? Life is shit a lot of the time. This isn't just a message for him. This is a message for everybody. Life sucks a lot of the time, right? Don't fucking focus on that, right? You got to realize, and you're going to have this, re a lot of people have this realization that focusing on the bad is unneeded. Why would you purposefully give yourself pain? Your life is so short. Why focus on the bad? Your life is so short, number one. So don't take your own life because then you've lost that, that little amount of time that you could have. Number two, don't, don't fucking focus on the bad because there's so much good that you can focus on instead. Why would you cause yourself pain? And a lot of people say, oh, why would I cause myself pain? I'm just going to kill myself. That makes no sense, right? That makes absolutely no sense because then you don't get to live for the good. Joe, we have so many kids capping about killing themselves. It's fake. I understand there's a lot of kids that come in my chat and lie about killing themselves for attention. Those kids are fucking losers, right? They're fucking attention-seeking cucks. What I'll say is I don't know if this kid is lying. So I'm not going to sit here and write it off because that's fucked, right? Look at what I said. You said this for real means a lot. That's the only thing that you said. I'm glad it means a lot. But, like, number one, if you are the kid that did that shit in my chat in, or in my Discord and you were racist to people, that's fucked. I don't know why you would do that. But regardless, do not kill yourself. Welcome for the sub, Panthers for the sub. All right, can we go? Can we go back to the game? I gotta go pee real quick, and then we'll get back into the game. That's my that's my that's my fair take about it, right? 
I understand it. Why, uh, not a lot of people are going to help you in your life. You want me to be flat out? I'll be realistic. Not a lot of people are going to help you in your life. You got to help yourself out, right? But when you get through those fucking shitty situations, you're for the better, right? You will be a 10 times better person. Less shit will be able to phase you than, than it was before, right? There's so much to life that you don't understand. No matter what situation you're going through, suicide is never the answer, okay? I'm going to go piss. Count me down 30. Panthers for the sub, Jack for the Forge Biddies. I told you a story about uh, getting cancer. Honestly, I was very depressed, but getting cancer gave me something to live for. Bro, like, I mean, I don't want to say, like, yeah, that's what I'm, like, yes, you're right. <sighs> and I don't know how I can relate that to Jeremiah, but it's the same, yeah, I can. I can relate it in the sense that you, you had to push through that, and pushing through that gave you meaning, right? Put you pushing through your cancer gave you meaning, and when you're past that, then you're way stronger than you were before. It's the same, right? It's the same. When you push through your depression, it will, it will get, it will make you stronger than you were before. Immensely. Is this kid still in my chat? Uh, Crucible said, or wait, Jeremiah said, Crucible messaged me on Discord. Stuff I want to talk about it. I just explained my side of the Discord thing. I didn't do that, but I don't know. Being treated bad, I'm used to it. Well, I don't know what you did on Discord. You got to talk to Cruz about that or one of my Discord mods. Mr. Riley, Jake, and Hunter for the sub. And Jack, thank you for the 400 bits and the fucking nice-ass message. You're right. Uh, Jack Beast. He said some out-of-pocket stuff in your Discord. I'm not going to unban him in Discord. If he said some out-of-pocket shit, he's staying banned in the Discord. This is not getting him unbanned. I will, but just because he said some out of pocket shit in the Discord doesn't mean I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna give him my genuine advice if he's depressed. All right, Hunter for the sub. All right, let's get back into this shit. What's Mina? Terrorist organization. Oh, will you stop that, please? Look, how many times have we seen a lone Everybody wolf? Everybody locked back in. Unfortunate for the sub. Everybody locked back the fuck in. Okay. Hold up. Am I in the right game category? I feel like I'm in the wrong game category. No, I'm in the right one. I have to be. Okay. Everybody lock in. All right, let's get back in. Nah, bro. People from Turkey that had their family die and they still want to live. Like, l live like if you want to kill yourself. Think about life like you have family, people, food, everything. You don't even have, uh, and everything. People don't even have a family and food and still want to live. Yeah. Release pathogens into the air. Nanosols aren't airborne. They can only be transferred via blood to blood contact. Answer call. Bioterrorism suspect named as Claire Mahek, a Kendarian intern at Kensington. TV off. Bro, what year is this? Like, this is some fucking futuristic Tell me shit. Can you retrieve our nanocells? Not directly. We'd need to extract a large blood sample to keep them active. From there, I'll use that as a roadmap to recreate the master batch. Seems simple enough. She has plenty of blood to spare. Not exactly. Her new bone matter is consuming her body's resources at an accelerated rate. If I remove that much blood in one go, she'll die. And if she dies before you extract her blood? Without a living host, the nanocells will just dissipate. Oh, this fucking so I, lady's about to say to kill her. Nah, this lady's about to say to kill her and take the nano cells. Either way, she dies. Okay. 
Amy, we're going to have to go for the option where we retain our asset. Natalie, I can't just... I'll get back to you. End call. What should we do? Bruh, I'm telling her dumbass to get the fuck down here. You know what I mean? What, what the fuck? Oh, we're going to have to retain the asset. You get the fuck down here and shoot her in the face. All right. All right. All right. We'll retain the asset. You come kill her. You come kill her. We'll retain the asset. What are you telling me? Bro, you tell I don't get paid enough to fucking murder this person. What the fuck? Louie for the sub. Can you do a rundown of what's happened? Sub oh my fucking God. Oh my fucking God. Oh my fucking God. This lady and this guy work for a fucking company that works on like futuristic stem cells, nano cells, a bunch of that shit, right? This lady somehow got the nano, somebody yoinked the nano cells and put them in this lady. This lady's been like vomiting profusely, right? And she's going to die. They need to retrieve these nano cells back because they're his, her life's work and they're like worth millions of dollars, right? That's it. Look for a full blood diagnostic. There has to be a way to get the nano cells out of her safely. Dr. Wakefield, please replace her IV. I can't risk any outside contamination. Wait, Jeremiah is the kid that said, I'm going to get revenge? Yeah, Crucible, is that is that the same person that you sent in the Discord? All right, whatever. Sure thing. Dr. Tennant. Somebody, Mandy said, is this the kid that sent us death threats? Yeah, if this is the kid that sent you death threats, yeah, bro. It's recent, it's not the same kid. Okay. Yeah, no, because there's a bunch of kids that send my mods death threats. Disturbing for the three. Think you missed my donut before this one. Uh, my parents passed away when I was 12. Uh, I went from being depressed to going to school for pharmacy. You got this. That's what I'm saying. And I'm sorry that your parents passed, bro. You were really young when they passed. Holy shit. You're here for the 300 bets. And I'm sorry I missed your, your bets disturbing. Somebody said, please, uh, or you here said, play my singing monsters. No. Are they about to kill her? Need to replace this, okay? Don't bite me. Don't bite me? Whoa. <laughs> Shit, sorry. <gasps> what was the, you know I mean? Wait, did he stab himself with it? Don't. Don't go anywhere. If he stabbed himself with it, then he just got it. That means he's infected. Who delivered this crate? Oh, see, when we arrived this morning. Well, it's in the way. It needs to be moved. Then pick it the fuck up. You're standing there staring at it. It's in the way. It needs to be moved. Pick it the fuck up. That's like that dumbass shit. That's like... That's like when somebody's asking you to do... Have you ever had that? Like, like it's, only, it's always old people. They'll ask you to do something, but instead of just asking you to do it, they're like, damn, those lights need to be changed. Wow, looks like that light's out. Like, fuck. Just ask. Who the hell do I ask? I'm not asking Reese, but he just stabbed himself. I can't, who should I ask? Shit, who the hell is Amy? Am I Amy? I thought there's only four people in this room. Is that me? Oh, that's me. Yeah, I'll pick it the fuck up. Yo, she's old as hell. Don't worry about that. That's what we're here for. Thank you, Dr. North. That's what we're here for, picking shit up. Anyone could do that. She about to drop it. Yo. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, now nah, yeah, she's dead. GG's. Oh, oh she's yeah, dumb what? as hell. Help me. It's no personal. Yo! I'm shooting him in the face, bitch. Help me. 
Yo, they really beating the shit out of this old lady. Hit him in the head. Yeah, murk him. Murder him. Bro, you really missed that fucking step? Oh, I'm beating the shit out of him. Damn! Oh, shit! That bitch dead as fuck. That bitch dead as fuck. How Paris. Dr. North dead as shit. Ain't nobody give a fuck about her. All right. GGWP. Dr. North dead as fuck. Yo, she's, uh, she, it's over for her. She fucking inhaled some weird gas and got stabbed. Oh. Ah. 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 I already told you. She's, she's gone. What are you, Schmeagle? Help me. All right, well, if we're stuck down here, we can eat her body. Oh my god, we're actually gonna have to eat her body. Well, I think I'm gonna go for the legs first. <laughs> I knew there was something off about Malkin. What kind of a scientist has a fucking ponytail? Facts. <sighs> They're always bald. Oh, thank you. You're fine. Oh, oh, oh. Is Claire all right? I'm currently the safest person in this room. Good enough for me. Why are we in lockdown mode? It's detecting the poison from the acid bomb. It won't be in the air for much longer. Thanks for that. How the hell does she know that? Call Natalie Kensington. Who is this woman? Emily, where's Natalie? There's been an incident in the lab. Yeah, I can see that, and the biosecurity's kicked in. I need Natalie on the line right now. I don't care who she's with. Yeah, okay, she's in her office. I'll call you right back. And call. Cool. Okay. Yo, you taking that knife Let's out, chat? First. Get this cleaned up. I know they tell you not to take that shit out. I would want to take that shit out. I'm oh. taking that shit out. We'll be back in a minute, Claire. Don't go anywhere. What the fuck? No mistake, kid. Well, that needs to come out one way or another. Kensington could have at least left us some of her expensive whiskey. All right, just uh, rip it out. Tell a joker, stalk. slap him. Was this a fucking TikTok kiss or slap segment? Jesus Christ. Tell a joke. Slap? I'm gonna go slap. Ah! What the fuck? Ah! Oh! 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 Cold. Oh, oh she's about to die in there, too. Yeah, that's gushing pretty bad. I don't... I don't think that was a good idea to take that shit out. I have to clean this wound. No, 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 it'll be fine. We've got bigger fish to fry. Did you hear that? Yeah, what was that? He's bleeding out! Stop investigating! <laughs> Fucking help him! Rinse with water? Bitch, I don't know how to clean a wound. Search for disinfectant. Fuck. I feel like rinsing with water ain't enough. I feel like I gotta go for a disinfectant. Yo, can Wait you hold here. that? I'm gonna go see if there's something in the intensive lab. No, I mean, it's fine. Look, we need to figure out what the fuck is going on. But don't tell me there's gonna be another motherfucker here. I'm about to get bum rushed by some rando. Damn, that's about to hurt so bad. Hello? Can anyone hear me? Amy? Oh, uh, she's dying. The woman in the tube. The Claire, the girl in the tube's dying. Uh, ain't nobody give a fuck about you. I'm going to Reese. Okay. Sorry! Sorry! You're already dying either way. Sorry. Yep, you're already half dead. I can see I I can clean a wound better than I can fucking take nanotechnology out of your fucking blood system. Sorry. 
Just like Yemen. Don't mind me. <laughs> yeah, they fucked. I swear to God, if they kiss right now, that's about to be mad weird. Plumbing? No. Manny said, bro, Joe. What? Bro, you see the way they're looking at each other and shit? It's whack. Uh, you here for the three hundred biddies? Please play my singing monsters. I think I just read that one. No, I'm just saying. What do you mean you're just saying? Came from the void. You're feisty with the remarks today. Is that too feisty? Is that too feisty? Sorry, chat. If that's too feisty, I didn't think that was too feisty. I just think it's funny. Yo, chat, I'll, I won't make those comments if that's bad. That's my, that's my bad. That's my bad. I didn't think that was, I didn't think that was too bad. Y'all making Joe feel bad? Yeah! Oh my god, you're telling me he can't walk? What the hell is that? My god, get on one fucking leg, buddy. I'm not wheeling you around. Is there any security cameras we can check? On the computer, but I don't know how. He ain't even gonna that. check on her. She's just dead laying there. Thank you. <sighs> Joe, I was trying to make a joke. I don't care what you say. Yo, chat, do you not want me to make those comments anymore? Yes, meaning don't make those comments. No, meaning don't. Like, if that's bad, I won't. Oh, my God, I feel bad now? Well, I just don't want my chat to be, like, pressed. Like, if that's bad, that's like, like that. I, I just didn't think that was bad. It's not bad. Okay. Right, got it. These are the security cameras in the void. Who the fuck Shit. are they? Cavalry? In masks? What's the rumbling though? Sound doesn't travel in a vacuum. Oh my god, I'm about to stab her. If she don't shut the fuck up and let me do my goddamn work. Buddy, I'm about to pull that oxygen tube out of your goddamn nose. Go go to sleep. Everybody shut up. What are you bugging for? You're not living this either way. Yeah, uh, we literally just had the conversation. We take the nano shit out of you, you die. If we don't, you die anyway. Like, oh my god, shut up. Shit, they've deactivated the vacuum. No prizes for guessing who the brains of this operation is. God bless those security walls, eh? Then they got guns too? Uh oh. This is impossible. They would need unprecedented access to our security systems to be doing this. Uh, I would be a little bit more worried seeing that they're on the second wall and they're holding Uzis and they're about to come fucking murder me. They're her dumb cavalry. Look, they're Kandarian too. I knew you were part of something bigger. Lump us all together because they have the same features. Big eyes and big lips too. The divisions in my country are complex. Those bunch are not from my team. And now they're fucking with us. Answer call. Yo, I'm not going down without a fight. Like, I'm saying that right now. They got those damn guns and shit. Yo, I'm about to start chemical fucking warfare in that goddamn lab. I'm about to make a fucking, I'm about to make a nuclear bomb in that bitch. I'm about to start fucking, I'm about to start cooking up fucking napalm and, and fucking mustard gas and shit. Oh yeah, everybody's dying in that bitch. If I'm going down, everybody's going down. Nope. Amy, what's going on down there? You've been infiltrated, Kensington. Dr. Malkin was a plant. Thanks to him, Dr. North is dead. And so are my dreams of becoming a professional footballer. But you killed <laughs> Malkin. Yeah, as you know that. Emily checked security footage from the lab. I mean, does privacy even exist around here? 
There are three mass intruders in the void and they're armed. They've deactivated the vacuum and bypassed the security wall. I'm still alive. Make sure she knows that. Oh Five my security. god. Oh my god. I'm about to fucking bang on that shit like it's a fish tank. Shut up. Make sure she knows I'm still alive. Who asked? Who the fuck asked? No one asked. Fuck. Still enabled. You are safe no matter what. Well, unless they open the door with that magic laptop. I'll get onto this intruder situation. Oh, well, not that I'm not grateful, but why is lockdown mode still active? The poison from the acid bomb has dissipated and the bioprotector is containing Claire's infection. It must be detecting something else. The safety of London is paramount. We can't risk a bug getting into the city. Amy, you need to extract Claire's blood, especially if the intruders have come for her. The nanocells cannot fall into the wrong hands. Well, why wouldn't we, why, yo, this lady is trying to hide this shit, still trying to protect her dumbass asset. If we're trying to prevent a virus from going into London, why the fuck would we extract what they want? Wouldn't we just shoot her in the face so she dies and then the virus dies with her? Wouldn't that make more sense? She's still trying to get that fucking asset. Because if we pull the nanocells out, they could still yoink them. They could still take them from us. But if I kill her and the nanocells die, what? Freaking for the sub, unknown for the sub. There's uh, an easy way to prevent that. We smoke Claire. No! Bravo. Bravo. End call. Wow. Still can't keep your cool under pressure. That's she's keeping his cool. This. That makes sense. That's being sense. logical. We're her only hope at retrieving the nanocells. Yeah, she's gonna let us extract the nanocells and then kill us by gunfire. Wow. Leak much? All right, look, Parker Kaplani designed this lab, right? Do you think he built an escape route, a back door, anything? I don't know, we'd have to ask him ourselves. What now, Claire? Remove the dead people. Oh, what, like, what, like they're blocking your view? Oh, like they're blocking your view? You can't even fucking see them. Yo, I'm literally about to be that motherfucker from Finding Nemo. That, uh, Finding Nemo fish kid. I'm about to be that kid that fucking shakes the fish tank and shit. It's about to be me. Ah! Hold, on. Hold up. Shut up, Claire. Ah! Hold on. Banging on the glass and shit. Shut up. Jarquavius for the 10. Uh, in a few days, or I'm a few days late, but I decided if you or your mom got the num the money since you have the same B day, you won. Oh, I'm a few days late, but I had to decide if you or my mom got the money since you have the same B day, you won. You, me, and your mom have the same birthday, and then you gave me money instead of your mom. I <laughs> thank you for the ten, but I mean, you didn't need to give me money over your mom. 60 for the sub. Okay. All right, I being bet. dead ass, I'm about to make it some yo chat. Yo chat. There's gunmen coming to kill you. How do you scare them off? Cut the head off of the Russian guy and put it on a stick and put it in front of them. They did that in medieval times. They did that in medieval times. That's a fear tactic. If they're about to run in and shoot me with an Uzi and the first thing they see is Buddy's head on a stick, they're going to say, uh-oh. <laughs> they're going to say, uh-oh. I, I, don't, I don't know if I want to walk in here. But they're crazy, right? Fuck. They really did that? I'm gonna be like, yeah, bitch, and then I and then I'm set. This one. Enough with the Natalie. And then I make napalm. Remember those new skills I was telling you about? Well, advanced computing is one of them. Programming, coding, hacking. I prefer the term unsolicited browsing. Yeah, no, sorry, hacking is better. 
Look, I know you two are besties, but I find that lay a bit... Yeah. Let's access her camera. Give her a little listen. This is how scientists get killed, you know. Where did you learn to do this? If I told you, I'd have to kill you. He's typing on a fucking keyboard. Where did you learn to type? In second grade, I actually took it out of typing class. Hands on, hands on AD, on ASDF and GK, or JKL and the fucking semicolon. Where'd you learn to type? Ready? Wait, you shouldn't... Look, she's got nothing to hide. What's the issue? We're in this together. We need to cooperate if we're going to survive. Let him hack in. I ain't even need time for that shit. Go ahead. I'm trying to see what's going on. The three intruders in the void have managed to lock every lift and door giving us access down there. Whatever they've done has caused electrical blips throughout the entire building. There are questions. Have the security idiots announced an upgrade gone awry? No one can think this clear situation's any more serious than it already is. This seems planned, Natalie. There must be more traitors in our midst. Emily, please. Two people are trapped in that lab with our prized asset. They are our priority. Announce the security upgrade. So she is trying to save us? I clear the eyeways in case she calls. Who could the traders be working for? Let's ask the original. She's already dead. Let's ask the original. Bang on the glass. Wake up! Wake up! Fucking, just fucking slamming on that shit. Who, who do you think the traitor is screaming? Claire. Amy. What do you and your friends want? I'm not an espionage mastermind. They aren't with me. So how did all the nanocells end up inside you? Is it not totally obvious? No, it's not. You should listen to Professor Xavier over there. About what? Kensington. So she put them in you? <laughs> no. <laughs> not me. I swear to fuck if she dies, if this is some dumbass movie scene where she dies right as she's about to spit this shit up, she's going to die right before it comes out. She's going to say, it was, uh, 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 and then fucking die. Yep. Yep. Yep, here it is. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I'll give her morphine. Uh, tell me who the fuck it is, please. I swear to God, if she passes out, I'm going to be dead pissed. Thank you. Now tell me who did it! How long have you been at the complex? A year. We've always had passing conversations on higher floors, but I don't think you remember. I always wanted to work in this lab with you. Well, here we are. Claire, come on. Just tell me what's happening so that I can help you. Oh, I got them all. Oh my god, if you keep speaking in riddles, I'm gonna fucking kill you. For the love of god, just tell me who the fuck did it. What the fuck is with this fucking, this fucking gremlin crossing a fucking bridge shit. I gotta answer your dumbass riddle so you tell me the fucking answer. Just tell me. Fuck. Mina. Who's Mina? Claire. She's about as useful as a chocolate teapot. Answer. Ready for more cryptic bullshit? Answer call. 
Guys, you were right about the intruders. They've sabotaged the system and have electronically barricaded themselves in the void. Yeah. Tell us something we don't know, please. How are they bypassing our security system so easily? Kensington Corporation's dark plummets amid TV links off. to... Rescue plans are being made. Well, have you contacted Parker Kaplani? He designed the lab. He'll know how to get us out of here. We've been trying, but he could be anywhere on the planet right now. Parker has no compunctions about who he builds labs for, as long as he pays court. Excuse me. Somebody said she died. I don't think she died. If she died, they would have made a bigger deal about it. Wait, do y'all think she died? Nah, she looked like she just passed out. Uh, Hassan 60, Concy and Sig for the sub, Nimble for the 300 biddies. I recommend getting a 1440p monitor. It would conflict with streaming, but it, any, it makes anything you game look so much better. If it conflicts with streaming, no. Uh, Ace for the 500 bets. My birthday is today. Happy birthday. Best present is you streaming and Surgeon Tim was funny. Uh, was such a funny video. Thank you. Stop Emily hanging up. Let Emily hang up. One or two. One or two. One or two. Mm. Why, would I, why would I stop them from hanging up? What is Emily, that even going to do? Please. Give us something. Help us. Dr. Malkin, the three intruders in the void, Claire, they all infiltrated the complex expertly. What, another country in the space race? or Possibly. Well, they might be trying to steal the nanocells or destroy them. I'm going to move heaven and earth to try and get hold of Parker. Thank you, Emily. Bro, I Thank would be you. way, I would be way more stressed out Whatever if motherfuckers are coming to, to kill us. Is there anything else you can do in the computer system? I can hack the communication lines, get in touch with Parker Kaplani myself. Okay, awesome. You do that. I'm going to look for a way out of here. <coughs> are you okay? The air is getting stale down here. <gasps> oh, no, he got it. Oh, he got it. Nah, kill him. Nah, kill him. He's fucking sick, too, from that dumbass needle because he got stabbed with that fucking blood. Oh, nah. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. He's not good. Fucking coffin. Yeah, yeah, that's fucking cap. Oh, that's the air system. Possible. Even in lockdown mode, there's always a steady supply of oxygen. Oh, she's backing up. Lost something? Welcome back, Sleeping Beauty. I need something to get me past that vent cover. Yo, I'm putting a sheet over that fucking <laughs> over that fucking capsule bro she's so she passes out and wakes up at every fucking shitty moment like i'm like you know when you have a puppy and like they're in a cage and they're barking and when you put it over they stop barking because it like calms them down bro swear to god i'm just throwing the sheet over so she doesn't know what the fuck i'm doing because she just like stare she's just like watching us and making snarky ass comments Shut up. Fuck. Ninja for the 300 bits. Which house would you be in Harry Potter? I don't really know. Nimble for the 300 bits. It says it doesn't conflict. With, oh, I said it doesn't conflict with streaming. I still probably wouldn't get that. I like the monitors I have now. Meat for the sub guacamole for the 500 bits. Be have one, me and my bestie, Sabrina. Are you watching The Last of Us show? Will you play it on PC? Uh, no, I'm not watching The Last of Us show, and I don't know if I will play it on PC. Ace for the five gifteds. Dub in the chat for that. Thank you for the five gifties. Ace underscore Ace. I don't know if I'm saying your name right, but thank you for the five gifteds. Thank them for the five gifteds. Uh, if you got one, and thank you, Ace, for the five gifted subs. I appreciate that shit. What the fuck does delicate or crude mean? Delicate. Delicate.
<laughs> Bro, I'm saying delicate. Delicate or crude? Right, delicate. I'll block that shit and it'll be like, like, oh, nice and orderly and I won't break anything. Crude, I'm just going to break that shit. All right, so do we, be, do we be soft or hard? That sounded weird. Do we be delicate or crude? That's why they use those words. Because soft and hard sounds dumb as shit. Do we, one or two? Just one or two. Just vote one or two. Delicate or crude? Everybody's saying crude. I feel like that's bad, though. If I, if I break, then there's no, there's no way to reverse it. If I'm just, if I just smash that shit and I break it, D for the sub. I'm gonna go one. I'm gonna not listen to y'all. Yeah, like, unscrew it. Fucking going in that bitch and just smashing it down. Yeah, you need a fucking ladder. I always wished I was taller. Well, what, what, are you, what are you gonna be eight feet tall? I don't really think I don't, I don't really think even like somebody that's six five would be able to reach that shit. Oh, he ain't gonna be able to stand up. Hey, mate, do you need a hand? Yeah. <laughs> See, even with one leg, Wakefield is the MVP. Most vanishing person. Ooh. <laughs> Sorry. That was no. A harsh. No, no, no. I'm proud you've grown some whip. Come on. What are you, Santa Claus? He keeps tapping his fucking thigh. Do it. Bro, barbecue boy for the fucking 5,000 biddies. I leave you on this fine fucking quote chat. You stay classy, San Diego. Ron Burgundy, anchorman. Bro, I, yo. Barbecue boy, thank you for the 5,000 fucking biddies. Dub in the chat for that. I appreciate the fucking biddies that you've been giving all stream. <sighs> Anchorman. And this might be an L take here. I used to think it was like a 10 out of 10 movie. I recently rewatched Anchorman. It wasn't bad, but it was like, it was not as good as I remember it. It was like rewatching Grown Ups. You know what I mean? Like, like, have you guys, like, you watch Grown Ups 1, Grown Ups 2, you're like, oh, wow, these movies are so fire. You rewatch them. They're not as good as they used to be. It might be because I just know what's going to happen, but it, almost, it also might just be I don't like the plot anymore. It's always been mid. Are you high right now? No. No, it's still funny, but it's definitely, it's definitely not as good as it used to be. I feel like that's good, though. Grown Ups is gas. Grown Ups will forever be funny. Yo, I'm going to have an L take here. Adam Sandler's new movies are fucking dog shit terrible. Every Adam Sandler movie that has been, is, is newer than 2016 is terrible. Every fucking new Adam Sandler movie. Everyone. All the Netflix originals. Every new fucking movie. That Halloween one. Every one he has had since, since Grown Ups 2. He has never had a good movie. Everything before then was good. Everything before then was good. Longest Yard, Grown Ups 1, Grown Ups 2, Big Daddy, the one where he had to fucking go through all the schools. Hubie Halloween, yeah, no, that one sucked. Ha what about Hustle? I haven't seen Hustle. See, that one I can't, that one I can't say. Pixels was terrible. If you're sitting there and you're gonna try and tell me Pixels was a good movie, you really think Pixels was good? Oh, y'all have terrible movie taste. Y'all about to tell me the Emoji movie was fire. Get the fuck out of here. Crowley for the 300 bets. Nice job. This dumbass doesn't know how to pronounce delicate. Bro, I ain't ever read delicate, right? I've heard people say delicate. I've never read the word delicate. So I didn't know how it was spelled. Bro, is that sad that I'm 21 now and I haven't read the word delicate until just now? Bro, Barbecue Boy, again, thank you for the 5,000 biddies, bro. And W Anchorman quote. And Plazzy for the 300 biddies. Uh, thank you for getting me through almost committing suicide. You're my favorite streamer ever and will forever watch you. Love you, man. Thank you. Uh, w Message, I'm glad I could help. But uh, I'm not the one that got you through it. You got yourself through it. I might have aided you, but you definitely did that shit yourself. So W, you. Uh, but yeah, no. Adam Sandler has some fire-ass old movies. But like his new shit sucks. Okay. 
but yeah. yeah. At least no. Yo, he is staring yeah. at her ass, bro. <laughs> Let's take a video. Okay. I'm climbing through that shit and leaving in this motherfucker. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Three. One, two, three. Recap? Oh my god. Oh my god. How many fucking recaps do I need to do? They work for a corporation that, that uh, works on nanocell technology, which is like very futuristic and it has application on a lot of things. They lost these nanocells inside of this woman that's in the capsule. They need to get them out. If they get them out, she dies. There's people from another country that are traitors that are trying to get in and kill both of them and steal the nanocells. So they're trying to find a way out of that. That's it. Uh, somebody ban a big penguin. Uh, hold up. I'll actually do that if my mods don't. But he uh, said the N-word. Hold up. Bro, why are you saying the N-word, bro? Come on. Like, figure it the fuck out. Crowley for the 300 bits. Leaving stream. Are you going to be streaming tomorrow? Yeah, tomorrow will be React Day. The fuck is that? Reese, the vent continues behind the oxygen tank. You squeeze past it. Oh, she about to break that shit. Only one way to find out. Oh, uh, proceed with caution. Proceed with caution. Do not break that. If we break that, we die. Because then we'll fucking lose air. Oh, fuck. Why did... Yo, why did that scare me? Why did that scare me? Yo, why are there why, why are there lasers? What the fuck is the point of the laser? How did that scare you? It was unexpected. It was more so of a shock. I wasn't really scared. Made it. That's excellent news. I thought you were going to get stuck. I think there's something further on. It's a fucking massive raccoon that just fucking mauls her. Jesus Christ, what is this room? And she's never been in this room. Why is everything fucking broken? I ain't putting no band-aid on that shit. Fuck out of here. I'm hitting it with that. I'ma just I'ma just suck on the wound. Fuck out of here. Oh, band-aid that shit. Y'all put a band-aid on that chat. No, I'm literally going, I'm, I'm, I, I will never, I will never use a bandaid unless I'm genuinely bleeding bad. I won't use a bandaid. I will just, I'll just, I'll just hold it until it stops bleeding. Oh, it's quite cute. Marching wounds. I mean, mine is, mine is slightly more impressive. Mine put both of yours to shame. I hate her. <laughs> so anything else of notes up there? Just a storeroom. Shakespeare for some act for some.
Bro, it took them that long to get through the next fucking one. What's this deal? Oh, they need one more There's wall, and wall then they're next to us. And the lab door. Please tell me you got hold of Parker. Negative. Uh, I got hold of the CCTV footage from the past 24 hours. Okay. Are you sure you're not high, Let's Joe? 100 percent, dude. Why would I lie about not being high? Like, what is Faithy for the sub? Ever since I turned 21, like fucking three days ago. What is with motherfuckers' obsession with asking me if I'm high? I'm not high. Am I going to get high tomorrow on stream? Maybe a little bit. I don't know. What is with motherfuckers? Oh, are you high? No. Why would I lie? See if there's anything helpful. Roger that. Oh, see, that was him setting up that shit. Fucking sneaky bastard. Oh, Wait. this is where she gets sick. Claire got access to the lab? Was that your master batch? How did she get that level of clearance on her ID card? Wait, what were you? You injected yourself. She did it to herself, what? yo! I'm banging on that fucking glass! I'm banging on that fucking glass! You lying fuck! You lying fuck! Said, oh, I didn't inject- Oh, isn't it obvious who did it to me? Isn't it obvious who did it to me? You did it to yourself, dumbass. Yo, fuck her. Nah, fuck her, dumb. Yo, she is literally such a fucking cuck for that shit. Oh, I'm killing her. Oh, I'm murdering her right there. Oh, that motherfucker's getting murked. Holy shit. In the love shit, though. The nano cells need time. Yo, to I'm literally stabbing her. I was able to get out of the complex before feeling the effects. What the fuck is she doing in the storeroom? I destroyed all the duplicate nanocells too. What? I didn't authorize any. Yo, I'm beating the fuck out of her, bro. She did. She lied. She's gonna get me killed. She gonna get me killed. She lied to me. She tried to do all this whack at. Yo! W fucking Ray! screen for the raid of 446 dub in the chat for that i appreciate the raid bro yo the voice cracks i did not have a voice crack there you capper i did not have a voice crack true it for the sub too thank you for the raid everybody go follow bruce green if you don't know bruce green appreciate the raid bro if you don't know me i'm joe bartolozzi twitch streamer youtuber tiktoker i do all three we're playing this fmb game right now called the complex Quick rundown, uh, if you've never heard of the game. If you don't know what an FFB game, it's basically a movie game where you have decisions and stuff, and they affect the game, they affect the ending. It's very interesting. Anyways, uh, what's going on right now? They work for a futuristic company that works on nanocells. Uh, this lady injected herself with nanocells uh, and destroyed all the duplicates, which we're just now finding out. Uh, we have to get the nanocells out of her if we don't want to lose like 30 years of progress. Uh, and at the same time, there are simultaneously people from another country that are coming to kill us and take the nanocells out of her. The lady that injected herself with the nanocells lied to all of us. Uh, and is that it? Oh, she lied to us and said that somebody else did it to her. Did I catch everybody up? Chat, was that the recap? Was that the recap? Yo, W raid again. Thank you, Bruce Green, for the raid. Appreciate that, bro. Genuinely. Whoa. I don't even know if they're still here. I think that's basically the whole recap. And now that works for the chatters that were about to ask for a recap too. All right. W recap, W raid. Let's get back into it. So you were just stealing the master batch for employers to replicate? Who? Who was it? Was it the Russians? No, I was heading to MI6. To... Mm. Okay. 
Oh, fuck. Joe, me. I ain't giving her morphine this time. You ain't getting morphine this time, dumbass. Oh, last time I was nice. Oh, this time, oh, you're suffering. Oh, oh, you're suffering now. Nah, let her sit in that pain. Yo, she really just screwed all of us over. She about to get us killed, lied to us, and destroyed my life's work. Bro, I'm opening that shit and punching her in the face. No doubt. Bro, you're not, no, you, she's not living this shit anymore. Nope. GGWP. All right, for the rest of the stream, we're going to be going no face cam here. Um, For the rest of the stream, we're going to be doing a no face cam stream. Um, All right, let's get back into it. MI6, why were you taking them there, Claire? It's a go! All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. What happened? Just had a massive voice crack there. Damn, dude. When is that shit going to stop? I think it's because I keep losing my voice, bro. I just turned 21. I saw voice cracks. My God. Maybe that means my voice will get deeper if it's not the fact that I'm losing my voice all the time. Hi. Bro, why are motherfuckers saying McRib, please? Stop saying McRib, please. Yo, aliens, I'm going to ban you if you type McRib one more time. Swear to God, bro. You type that shit like 30 times. We got a hold of Parker. Half true. I was already en route. I get alerted every time shit hits the fan in one of my labs. We also have the identities of the three intruders. Sending them through. Buddy is casually wearing a fedora. Those were the motherfuckers in the bathroom. Those are the traitors. Those are the traitors. They were the people that we saw right before we walked into the bathroom. Nah. No, we saw them in the beginning of the game, didn't we? I remember this, bro. He got that mean mug. They're from last year's batch of Kendarian interns. Sleepers, like Malkin. Yeah, 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 guys, guys, guys. There's one security wall between them and us. What have you got? What are our best options, Parker? I need 10 more minutes to study these blueprints. That lab was built to contain world-altering alchemy. So excuse me if backdoors weren't part of my thinking. Somebody said, why did you post that on TikTok? What do you mean, why did I post that on TikTok? I posted a TikTok of this kid punching wood. See, like this shit, like what do you mean? Why did I post that on TikTok? Why did I post the TikTok that I posted? Because he was punching wood. What? What is that whack-ass question? Also, I got to go back into the game capture. I didn't even notice I wasn't on game capture. All right. See? End call. Reese. What? Do you want to listen to a fucking bullshit about nanocells again? Also, I actually do need to post on TikTok chat. One or two. Not trying to interrupt and pause for the thousandth time. One or two here. Gotta post. Gotta post. Looks like people are going one this time. Almost everybody goes two. All right. All right. Posted. Back into it. Ten minutes to think without all that shit. What is that, a jewel pod? Look, I didn't want to hand this over. It's not meant for you, but fuck it. This is the last ever mango jewel pod. I didn't want to hand this over to you. But it looks like I'm not going to make it. I was going to hand it down to my daughter, but... I mean, you might as well use it for all the pain that I've caused you. You need to see the truth about Kensington and Kinder. What is it? 
just watch. Careful, Emmy. Always. Yo, she grabs my arm, I punch her in the nose. I break her nose if she touches me. Swear to God. Oh my God, her hands look so gross. Wait. Nope, punching her in the face. Oh. <laughs> Yo! Yo! Fucking right. Yo, literally, literally the fucking quickest jab you have ever seen. You just infected me with a deadly disease. Fuck it. Fucking right, yo, right into the nose. I'm breaking that fucking nose, dude. It's shattered. It's about to be looking, it's about to be looking like Owen Wilson's nose. Fucking right to the left. Right to the fucking left. Crooked as shit. Yo, that actually about to fucking break that shit. Nah, it's over for her. It's over for her, bro. Nah. Bro, I don't know why she's being so peaceful. If they gave me the option to punch her in the face, I would. Swear to God. Two files. Kensington and Picnic. Which one do you want to watch? Oh my God, why can't we watch both? Picnic. If this is literally just a file of that- Look. You've forgotten the wine, but remembered your phone. Typical. <sighs> Nina's mad at me these days. <laughs> well, I'm sorry I forgot the wine, okay? Yeah. Bro, onion bhajis, mm. egg mayo, <laughs> tomatoes. <laughs> Claire takes too many selfies in London. <laughs> Not that much. <laughs> Not, look, yeah. I'm and this is where, and this is where I put the, and this is where I put the fucking blanket over her dumbass capsule. This is where I say, oh, oh, you liked watching this? Mute, mute capsule. Sorry, sorry, sorry. You spit your blood, you spit your infectious blood on me. Fucking open that shit back up, punch her in the face, close it. Yeah, fuck you. Nah, that shit's over for. Showing the surroundings. Look, look. Look how pretty this grass is. Come on, let's, let's take a picture. Look at the camera. Smile. <laughs> what the fuck? The hell was that? I think my mind's concluding the same thing as yours. So, do you really play it? Want to watch that? Please. If this gets over, we'll be answering to the UN. Kensington, Ma. What's the problem? We quashed uprising villages. And you got human trials to assess your technology. Two birds, one stone. But three whole villages. Your scientists need not know how the data was acquired. Oh, the they murdered three whole villages? Discretion. We trust you are the same. Most certainly. Make sure of it. Most certainly. Or we will. What accent is that? Is that Scottish? Most certainly. That's Scottish. It has to be. That's not Irish. It's thicker. Moth and funny for the sub. Damn, so now do I feel bad? Now do I feel bad about uh, saying I would punch and break this lady's nose? Mm, she still spit blood on me. government in Italy, Kensington, experimented with your nanocells. You could have just told me that from the start. 
So I don't feel bad. I, you, know, you know why I don't feel bad? Is because when I asked you what was going on, you could have just told me. We could have avoided all of this. We could have avoided all of this. If when I asked you why you are infected, you just told me from the start. And then none of this would have ever happened. And we would have been perfectly fine. And I wouldn't kill you. But now you spit blood on me. Uh, you infected my friend. And now you need to die. On my people. My village. My parents. My sister Mina. They're all killed for opposing the dictatorship. Natalie was making duplicates of the master badge behind my back. My tech killed people. And you were taking all the evidence for my six. In that USB and in your veins. Now the Supreme Leader has activated a sleeper cell in the complex to cover his tracks. Yeah, not to mention Natalie's. Why didn't you tell us this before? Facts! I didn't trust you. Kid, you're dumb as hell for that. We're all about to be here anyway. Oh my God. Answer call. Reject call. Hey, man. Bitch, I run this fucking show. Reese, Reese, I run this fucking show, okay, buddy? I paid the $9.99 to play this fucking game, right? I paid the $9.99 on Steam to play this fucking game, buddy. So when I press accept call, you accept the fucking call, right? Because that's how this fucking works. I run the show. You're a fucking character, right? I'm, I'm the puppet master in this shit. Not you, right? You're a fucking character in the show, right? So when I fucking press accept call and you say reject, now you're a dead man, right? Now you're a dead man. Now I'm going to kill you. Now you're fucked. Everybody making fun of my headset dent. Shut up. We need to take a minute and think about this, okay? The headset dent's wild. Is it that bad? Fine, I promise. Hey, look, I know a rush decision when I see one. Are you not going to expose Natalie after what you've just seen? We need to deal with our current. Oh, I am, but I still don't like you. Commence. Plus, I, I really need the toilet again. But he's got the shits. But he had what I had on Monday. Oh, you believe this isn't the weirdest place I've taken a ship. Do you need me to stay and help you? Ye no, no, you're fine, you're sped. I'll be Where's the weirdest up? place y'all ever took a shit? A real, a full porta potty. Not like full to the point where I was like, like it was like, there, like the shit was probably like this far away from the toilet seat. That was probably the worst place I ever took a shit. I never pooped outside. I did go on a camping trip my sophomore year uh, at the end of the year, and there was kids that would shit outside because it was six people. I think I've told this story before. It was six people to a cabin, right? And there was only one toilet in each cabin, and half of the toilets clogged. And so kids would poop outside. And this one kid, <laughs> this one kid shit outside. And then... <laughs> And then one of my classmates fucking stepped in it. And then we, and it was his only pair of shoes. And so we were on the bus ride to go to like some team building exercise or some shit. And one of my friends, it was, it's the whole bus smelled like human feces. Because he, he, he couldn't get it out of the bottom of his shoes, right? Because it just mushed into the bottom of the shoes. And so he just threw him out the window. He just threw him out the window. And then the kid didn't have shoes anymore. For like the rest of the trip. Okay, okay. 
Hey, if we get out of here, will you quit like you said? Pass. I never thought I'd have to answer that question. Oh, you do the right thing, you always do. Bro, stepping and shit is the worst. Because then you gotta grab like a twig. You you know, when you step in shit, there's like a multi-step process. You step in the poop, and then you gotta scrape it on the grass to get the initial chunks out. And then you gotta grab like a twig that fits in between the fucking ridges. And then you gotta do like the fucking wedge method where you like scrape it out of the fucking like the ridges in your shoes. And then you gotta re-scrape and then you wash. It's like a multi-step process when you step in poop. How do we always get on, to, on the topic of shit? I don't know. Frosty for the 300 bits. Moth for the sub. Well, this time it was because he was talking about taking a shit. A habit I wish I had. Well, I might have rubbed off on you if you'd stuck around. Yo, he better ask her to wipe his ass. Why'd you leave, Reese? The absurdity. Not knowing whether... Saving someone was the right thing to do if it condemned them to a life of pain. It's too much for me. Coward isn't the man for you anyway. That wasn't your call to make. We were a team. Hindsight's a bitch, eh? Heard of Mr. Crack in Fortnite in Eritrea. Fortnite? Where can I sign up for this war-torn world tour you guys were on? I don't want to ignore her. That's a bit rude. I don't want to ignore her. Enough with the wise prize player. I'm not in the mood. Fortnite? 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 Fortnite, you say? I know how you feel, Amy. You lost people that you love. My feelings are trivial compared to yours. The sense of betrayal, I mean. Come on, give us a break. I meant Natalie. It was a dream come true, getting an internship here. A village girl from Kindar, coming to London to work, to live, to love. Funny story, <laughs> on my first day here, I was super late because I thought there was a station in the complex. Turns out I was- Uh-huh. 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 Yeah. Oh, you were late? Uh-huh. Oh, sorry. Uh, what? Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, no, I didn't ask, though. Mm-hmm, really. Wow, that's crazy. Looking at the Jordis tube map, the disused and unfinished stations. Yeah, that's right, the um, half-built station under the complex. Tabitha Greens. We're so far underground, we must be right. Bro says it's a bit rude to ignore her after threatening to kill her. Well, yeah. I mean... Just because I said I, I'm going to kill her by the end of it doesn't mean that I don't have manners, okay? Just because, just because I said that she betrayed me and so I'm going to break her nose doesn't mean that I'm going to be rude in conversation, right? I can still be, I can still be chivalrous in that manner. Done. Yeah, you might be right, Claire. Thank you. Anytime. What did I say? We can't go across the void. We tried going up into the vent, but we haven't tried going down. To Tabitha Greens. You need an access point. We might have one. Reese is sitting on it. The toilet? Yo, you're bugging. You think I'm crawling through a damn toilet. Uh-uh. What do you have to know? I need something that will remove the entire toilet quickly. Bro, you're not fitting through the toilet. Are they saying they're going to try and crawl through the fucking toilet hole? Like, I understand they're removing the toilet, but even the actual hole, like the tube. Are they saying they're going to chuck something down it? 
That ain't working. Flush yourself. This isn't Looney Tunes. <sighs> chemistry? What, am I going to throw a firecracker in it? Yeah, do chemistry. I'm going to see what the fuck she's about to cook up. to get your hands dirty. Hold up. Let her cook. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Let's see what she's about to do here. Oh my god, what is this, a slow roast? You gotta cook faster, now I gotta restart it. Oh my god, now I can't even fucking hear it. What is she doing? I always wanted to see what a full block would do. She immediately blows up. That probably blew up the fucking building. Oh, you are positively insane. <laughs> so now the big question, how far below us is Tabitha Green's? Looks deep. I, I am never crawling down that. I am never crawling down a dark ass sewer drain. Buddy, I don't care what's on the line. Nope. Not doing that. Go check it out. Oh my god, here we go again. Bro, give me a flashlight. Drop something big, drop something small. Drop Amy. Drop something small. I gotta see where it goes. Like a little rock. How far down is it? Uh-uh. <laughs> Yo, that fell for like 10 seconds. That fell for like 10 seconds. What is that shit? Fucking six stories down? More than that. That was like a skyscraper. What the fuck? Shit. Oh, and they're breaking through. What a strategy that is. They're going to shoot their way in. Their bullets won't dent these doors. They were built to withstand much more than that. The Void's last resort defense mechanism is the kicker. When it detects a rogue pathogen, it generates a white heat flash to eliminate the threat. <coughs> Yo, he's sick as fuck. Yo, he's sick as fuck. Nah. He's already hardwired into the system. We are fucking fucked. Yo, he looks terrible. Answer call. Guys, the intruders are almost in, and we know why they're here. Parker, what options have we got? Enough! How Parker was accessing the lab situation. Yo, I'm about immunity. to tell her and her dumbass haircut to shut the fuck up. Yo, oh my god. Oh my god. Get the fuck out of here, lady. You telling me to shut the fuck up? I'll hang up on your dumbass. Fuck you. For bypasses, we saw records of who gained entry in the last 24 hours. Claire entered using someone else's ID credentials. Yours, Amy. That's impossible. I've got my ID card right here. Amy didn't help me. I snuck into her office and I copied her credentials off a computer. You're the liar, Natalie. You don't have a voice here, Claire. But we know about Kinder. Reese. We have proof. Lots. Nonsense. Look, the intruders are Natalie and Kindar's way of making sure that we die with their dirty little secret. We know that you hack your own security, Natalie. That's the Yo, she about to pull out a gun and kill everybody. Yo, I'm tackling that. Yo, if I'm that, if I'm that dude in the back, if I'm that big motherfucker, yo, I'm hitting her with that. Bang! Right to the fucking, right in the fucking temple. I'm dropping her, bro. Oh my god. What do you say? What do you say? You killed a village of fucking, you killed three villages of people? Oh. Wham! Right into the fucking temple. Hacked in easily. Reese has been hacking the system. He isn't an employee here, is he? What's your story, buddy? He spent the last few years bouncing between pharma companies around the world. A mercenary. Who side are you on, Wakefield? Continue accusations. Emily, I thought you said that you did your due diligence. 
slack on your part. Seriously. Her access to Kensington Corporation is only second to yours, Natalie. That's ridiculous. I'd never. Even Parker showed up unannounced. Don't drag me into this. Well, come on. Everyone knows you work for anyone who pays your quote. All I know is that if they get in, the nanocells are gone forever. Natalie, please. Look, we aren't traitors. Help us. Stall them. Do something. So you better hang up on me. Amelia, regardless of what we think of each other right now, you're one of my closest friends. Parker. So we're trusting these guys now? Yes, we are. Can the void jam electronics? Negative. Could you reinitialize the vacuum? Two of them aren't wearing helmets. I can't. They've locked us out. Reese could. But we just said that we have. We just we just said we have the shit saying that she literally broke fucking like national law and she's still going to help us. That makes no damn sense. Infinity for the 300 bits, Frosty for the 300 bits, Moth for the sub, uh, Funny Bone for the sub. I did a poop on a camping trip and there are no toilets, so I dug a hole and, and popped a squat and then a centipede bit my ass or almost bit my ass. What the fuck? 60 for the forge bits. One time I was over at my aunt's and somebody was in the bathroom, so I shit in the sink. You shit in the kitchen sink? What, did you fucking stomp it down? That is menace shit. You pooped in a sink. What did you wipe your ass with? Fucking paper towels? Johnny for the sub. Tommy for the fringe, but he says happy birthday. Bit late, but thank you, Tommy. His computer down there is hardwired into the system. Oh, I... oh, somebody said, oh, you turn on the garbage disposal. Just grind that shit up. Ugh. Okay, tell me through it as fast as you can. Help me, me. Mm, Go to the door. Mm, go to the door. Uh, go to the door. You spit blood on me. I'm not forgetting that. We have bigger matters to attend to. And they're here. This was a good decision to go to the door. Yo, what the fuck is he cooking up? Holy shit, but he's typing at the speed of light. Oh, he's about to pass out. He's infected. Did Parker tell you how to turn the vacuum back on? He did. Oh damn! Are they really it's about to? Are they really about to die? Oh, he's hacking back, though. This is about to be a hacker war. We're not out of the woods yet. All right, they're still unlocking the door. One down, two to go. Am I, am I an idiot in saying, isn't that a really stupid idea to sh shoot at a metal door? Couldn't that ricochet and fucking kill you? Like if you're if you're shooting somebody said Joe recap one of my mods can you type out a recap or some shit because this I'm not doing a fucking tenth recap bro it would like it would I'm just saying if you're shooting at something that's that solid if you're shooting at something that's that solid it would bounce it could bounce back that's what I'm saying even if it doesn't bounce directly back it could start ping ponging off the walls and shit. Mercy for the three hundred bets I left to go to the store for an hour at the start of the stream I come back. To stories about the weirdest places, chat had to pop a uh, squat. I think I missed something. Oh, that was just an off-topic five-minute rant about the weirdest place my chat has ever shit. Come on. Somebody really just asked, how is he shooting a gun in a vacuum? You know you can still fire a gun in space, right? Am I wrong? 
pretty sure you can still easily shoot a gun in a vacuum. I don't think I don't think that matters. I don't think being in a vacuum affects yeah. If you shot a gun in yes you can shoot bro. Yo can you shoot a gun in a vacuum? <sighs> Fires can't burn in vacuum spaces but guns can still shoot. Bro, I'm literally ratioing the shit out of y'all. You can shoot a gun. You can shoot a gun in space. And you know how I know this? Because I remember watching a YouTube thought experiment that if you were in space and you needed to go somewhere, you could shoot a gun and use the recoil to direct you. Suffocate, you bastards. Damn, he really suffocated that fast. I feel like I could have held my breath a little bit longer than that. I would have hit him with that. <gasps> and then I would have held that shit. All oh, that made me lightheaded as fuck. Okay, I'm good. Damn, they're really about to get in. There's only one other guy left. Damn, they just killed him too! Nah, and he about to stumble in. Now it's bro, but now it's a two v one, bro. But now it's a two v one. I've played Valorant, I've played League of Legends, I've played Fortnite. Right? Yes, you don't have a gun. Two v one, two v one. The odds are in your favor, regardless of scenario. Right? The guy has a gun. They have chemicals. <laughs> They have chemicals. Call Natalie Kensington. I'm okay. Answer call. Oh, thank God. We saw the lab door didn't open. Good work, Wakefield. Appreciate the guidance, Parker. Yo, he looks to awful. Lead, he looks like he just did You're heroin. Still unarmed intruder out there, Parker. What else do you have for us? I could go for Natty's internet. Unplug the lab. Plug it back in. That will kill lockdown mode and the vacuum for 60 seconds. You guys can then escape before everything initializes. Emily has a security team poised to handle the last intruder. No, that's a shit plan. He's standing right outside the door. Fucking security team of sprinters wouldn't make it down before he wastes us. He's right, Parker. It's a calculated risk worth taking. Okay, well, when could you do this? Whenever you're... When you get clear as blood. Question. Why haven't they just sent anyone down to save them? Did they address that in the in the game? Why haven't they sent down like other people to like come get them? You know what I mean? Oh, it's in lockdown. It's in lockdown mode. Okay, they did address it. They did address it. They did. Fuck, Natalie. It auto locked down because yes. of the chemical release. It will kill her. Yeah, when they opened that shit, it locked everything down. Yeah, it did. When they opened that thing in the beginning of the game. But she's gonna die anyway. She'd be sacrificing herself to save millions. Now I'm telling her to shut the fuck up. Think, Amy. We can't start over again. This has been our lives for the past four years. We're not the only country trying for nanocells. I'm not a murderer. You're a monster, Kensington. Just take the blood, Amy. Time is running out. Deal or no deal? Is that the assistant talking to me? Is that the fucking assistant telling me what to do? Is that a literal no power motherfucker trying to tell me, trying to, trying to boss me around? The boss's fucking bookkeeper trying to tell me what the fuck to do? Maybe you uh sit the fuck down, dumbass. No deal. End call. Ratio. 
We're trapped in a corner here, Emmy. There has to be another way that doesn't involve killing Claire. There isn't. We're trapped. Yeah, by Natalie. The lab's in lockdown mode because she ordered it. There's no other chemical threat outside of Claire's bioprotector. Yeah, there is. Actually. Buddy, buddy, get out of here. I'll be bleeding out of his eyes and shit. Ugh. How? I should have brushed over my needle handle. <laughs> Look, this is a Mexican standoff we're gonna lose. It won't be long until I'm like Claire, and eventually the oxygen will run out. So Parker's crazy plan of opening that door is our only hope. You've changed your tune. Maybe Natalie will rescue us. Yeah, you want to bet? All the evidence of her actions in Kindar is down here. The nanocells are our only leverage. Take her blood, however much you need. Yo, she spits on me again, I swear to God, I break her nose. She's sweaty as hell, too. Ugh. Claire, give me your arm, please. Ew! Ew, 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 ew. But he has pink eye now, too. Fuck. Hold up, I gotta move this mask. God damn. Ugh. Fucking, what's wrong with her eye? I thought you were different. Your arm. Fuck you. Bro, I will jab you in your fucking eyeball. Mm, aggression. Imagine she stabs herself with a needle, too. Oh, God. Stop. I I've got enough. What the fuck are you talking about? Don't stick it in. <laughs> That's what she said. Reese. <laughs> Just close the bioprotector. Claire can live to fight another day. Nope. <laughs> nope. Too late now. It's about time I contributed an escape plan. What? While Parker was talking me through the vacuum reset, I realised that a full lab reset wouldn't be much different. We don't need those pricks upstairs. But if you reset the lab... Yo, I gotta piss so bad. I know I'm pausing at a shit at a fucking climactic time. I'm gonna fucking piss myself if I don't go to the bathroom. Count me down 30 seconds. Fuck. Respond to my manager. All right, back to it.
Tank for the sub. Merc Chief for the 300 bats. Uh, left to... Oh, wait. I already read that. They'll be alerted. That's where things get creative. I hacked into the lab security camera and recorded the last three minutes of you preparing to extract Claire's blood. I'm so tired of this song. Nah, it's still a dub song, bro. I can output that three minutes I'll of play the shit out of it until I don't like it anymore. While you escape, I think you're following orders. How did you come up with this? Sorry to move it. <laughs> okay, but what about our last remaining obstacle outside? And why are you speaking in the second person? I'm going to take him out. But he thinks this is die hard. As soon as I step into the void, that heat flash will trigger. Maurice, you've lost it. If I die in here, lockdown mode ends and he gets in. If I die out there, so does he. And you, you have a chance. I've been the weak link. It's time to become an asset. Just take Claire, run, and save her. Uh, uh, one or two. Well, aren't, aren't? they both gonna die anyway because the claire's infected and he's infected so like either way i kind of just have to prioritize my escape now because he's gonna he's gonna get pretty bad pretty fast yeah most people are saying two i'll accept it mm -hmm. good shit chat no 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 look i chose this okay that's how you make a life. Every single choice along the way. Imagine he sneezes blood on her right now. He just fucks her over. I fucking hate you. Oh, they're about to kiss. Do not kiss that man. He is infected. I swear to God. Okay, good shit. You know, I went back to that beach. And Kindle. To face it. That woman was there. Dima. My God, I forgot about that. Her. She called her Amy. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yo, get your fucking nasty ass hand off of me, bro. Appreciate the sentimental moment. You have a deadly disease. So please get off of me. Back up six feet. Have you ever heard of COVID-19? Yeah, we're going to run that one back because this is even worse. Stand the fuck back. You're bleeding blood out of your eyes. Believe in you. No, do not kiss him. Oh, my God. Oh, my. <coughs> oh, see. Yeah, no, he's coughing the blood, too. Back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. Yep, 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 yep. And now there's probably a blood particle that just got on. I'd tell you not to kiss anyone carrying a life-threatening pathogen. <laughs> yeah, leave room for Jesus on this one. Back up. I appreciate the sentiment, though. More than you know. <sighs> oh, she better have that hysterical cry. You already know. One of those. Wait. Oh my god, how many damn times are what we gonna change it? the plan? Switch places with me, Reese. At this stage, you have a far better chance of surviving than I do. Good shit. Good shit. I'm taking that. Come on, Come Reese. On. Come on, Reese. Come on, Reese. All the Come on, Reese. Come on, Reese. Come on, Reese, and then you two can live together. Make sure the world sees it. No, Claire, I'll do it. Drop it. The bio protector will stop the lab. Yo, that was the most, that was the most half-assed. No, Claire, I'll do it. You know, in the back of that motherfucker's mind, he's like, good shit. Good shit. I hope she, I hope she fuck. Cause you know, he has to say, he can't immediately be like, okay, yeah, fine. Cause that means he never wanted to do it to begin with. If the second somebody says, okay, I'll take your place. He's like, deal. Then, like, Q didn't want to do that. So he's like, no. No, please. I'll do it. <laughs> no, please. Let me be the one. <laughs> like, what the fuck? In your infection. And you two can escape. Oh, 
shit! Come on! See, like, I've been dissing Claire this whole game, but once we saw that shit, like, I understand why she's been doing all this and she's been, like, a dickhead, because, like, literally fucking Kensington's the reason that her whole family died. But her logic is right that she's more likely to die because she's been sick for, like, days now. Yeah, my whole chat's saying one. All right. I promise we'll expose Natalie. And we'll share your story with the world. Thank you. I can't be the fuck out of this thing. <sighs> Jesus! Starting to look like Deadpool. Damn, that's that, that's that Call of Duty nuke sound. That's that fucking Call of Duty ghost shit. Did you do that, Parker? No. I'm sitting here. Yo, he trying to rest her up while he got his arm around her like uh, that. Thank you. Wait, why is he going in this? I'm genuinely kidding. Yo, what are they doing? <laughs> I don't remember what the plan is. Kind of forgot that along the way. Um, I know that she's getting sacrificed, but kind of don't remember what they're doing. Anybody anybody remember what's, what the plan is? Why is he getting in the tube? To keep him alive. Yeah, they're switching places, but why? She's going to kill that one guy that's going to break in. And then she and then and then Amy's going to escape. Okay. Oski for the sub guo for the 3 bets. I'm about to get into a lawsuit because the landlord wants to up my rent from 1800 to 2500. And the house is a one room. Your rent's 2500 a month in a one room. He's trying to fight me, so I'm about to win this case. Bro, good shit. $2,500 a, a month rent for a one room? Where do you live? Fucking, what do you, what do you live in? LA? New York City? San Fran? What the fuck? $2,500 a month. Oh my God, for one room? How much is that a year? Bro, that's fucking 30 grand a year in rent, right? Wait, even eighteen hundred, bro. That's fucked. All right, hold up. Let's do this. Bro, thirty grand a year in rent. Oh my god. Oh my god. God, for one person? Holy shit. IXT for the sub. Bro, that's nuts. That's nuts. Oh, did he already die? Oh, God. Barefoot and everything. Chemical threat detected. Flash initiated. Imagine she died to the heat flash. Burr weep, burr weep, burr weep. Alpha system reset complete. Nailed it, Claire. All looks good to me. Yeah. She's going to get the nano cells. Well done, Amy. How the I hell did they hack that? How the hell did they hack that to fucking look like that? What was that? Nothing. What did she say? 
Three minutes. He pre-recorded it. Oh! Oh, he pre-recorded her about to stab her. Nah, that's what it was. Hold up, bro. Somebody ban this weird motherfucker from my chat. All right, there we go. Yeah, I'm grabbing that gun, too. Yo, Amy, fuck that. Get a machine gun. Facts. Damn, is that his body? Is that his body? It disintegrated him that fast? No shot. You got liquids and shit? Bro, he's ash already. Mm-hmm. Ah! Oh. Yo, I'm not getting anywhere near that motherfucker's blood. Change out of my lab suits. They'll draw too much attention. Oh, he looks awful. It? Pretty fucking bad. I'm not. You see the bone? I'm gonna go to the disabled toilet and grab the fold-up wheelchair. Okay? Change quick. Yes, ma'am. Damn, what are we about to run and gun the fuck out of here? It must look like a right side. <laughs> Bro, I would not know how to use that. I would test the recoil first. You give me an Uzi, I never fucking fired that shit in my life. I would have to fucking, I would have to do a test shot, right? That gotta be TOS, it's fake. It's not real gore. Bro, I'm giving that, I'm giving that a test fire. Otherwise, I feel like I'm gonna shoot that bitch. It's gonna go fucking, <laughs> I'm, in a, I'm hitting with that. <laughs> fucking right to the ceiling. God damn, I'm gonna be holding that shit fucking tight as hell. Uh-oh. Emily really wasn't bluffing about the security team. Or she's just casually holding that gun. Okay, there's an exit out of the back of the building. It'll be way less guarded. How are they gonna cure him? Listen, what we're waiting for. Natalie's office is down there. Let's just get the fuck out of here. Yeah, let's. Let's finish what Claire started. On my six, here we come. Stop right there, Amy Tennant. Stop right there, Amy Tennant. I'm shooting that bitch. Yeah, I'm blasting that motherfucker. They ain't know I got that Uzi. I guess three minutes. They ain't know I got that strap. They ain't know I got that strap. I'm side shooting that bitch. I'm holding that shit fucking sideways. I'm hitting him with that fucking side spread. Nana cells in his system. Hand him over, and this can end without bloodshed. Well, that's clearly bullshit. Just do it, Amy. Uh, you're an assistant, fuckhead. Your dumbass fucking outfit. Your dumbass fucking outfit. Being the dumbass assistant to some to some immoral fuck that's been killing people across the world. Uh, I'm not listening to your dumbass. Aggression. I'm shooting her in the face. Good shit. Shoot him. Kill him. Literally. What if I him. shoot him right now? Then the nano cells are gone forever. Ooh. Steady. We need Reese alive. Yeah, 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 yeah. Reese wants to um, stay alive too. Amy. Oh, what happened to uh, sacrificing yourself, though? What happened to you? What happened to you being not afraid of that? I thought you were saying you were gonna kill. I thought you were gonna say you were gonna kill yourself for everybody at that point. This is a mistake, Amy. Right? Oh come on, Amy. You know, really Amy, you're bluffing, right? Like when I was saying I was gonna kill myself for you and everything, like I was like, I was just full on fucking wild card in that shit. I was just winging it. I was not gonna actually do that shit. You're gonna do this over a few Kandarians. <laughs> Fuck you, Emily. Assistant goes down. Bon. 
Drop like a fucking rock. You ain't eating that shit. Fuck you. And here's where we get the worst ending in the game, as always. And here's where we get the worst ending, because they're going to hold this guy captive. They're going to hold this guy captive. They're going to take all his nano cells, and then they're going to kill him. Okay, I will say though, isn't Amy kind of fucking stupid for not just hitting a three fire spray? You have a Uzi. Right? Couldn't you just have gone and just killed all of them? Mm, would have been a bit of a better ending there. That's kind of what I assumed was going to happen. I am for the sub, disturbing for the three. Uh, DTB for the three inch bits. Uh, you got me through really hard times. Thank you. On to another topic. I sharded under the bleachers in middle school. Yikes. Why did you shit yourself under the bleachers? Real for the sub. Uh, and Disturbing said I missed your dono. Oh, Disturbing for the 10. With her eye bulging, she looks like a dumbass puffer fish. Also, do you think their ass is puckering? Is that a reference to the Dark Anthology game? Well, their ass isn't puckering anymore because they're dead. Uh, but maybe at the time, yes. And Disturbing for the 3, and I'm sorry I missed your $10 dono. Thank you for the 10. Real for the sub. 12 months later, let's see what's going on. I'm Dame Natalie Kensington. Last year, Kensington Corporation Labs garnered a Nobel Peace Prize for the advancement of medical technology. Our breakthrough nanocell treatment was crucial to Gordon Grosvenor's Mars landing and has revolutionized the treatment of war zone injuries. Today, our medical tech becomes available to you and your family in all British hospitals. Global medical care begins here. like every person killed <laughs> I got like every person killed bro do we go look at the other endings that shit was ass bro I, I why do I get the worst ending every time the complex all endings bro that's so annoying that's so annoying. All right, there's nine endings. We got one out of the nine. See? Okay, arrest me. Do whatever. Just... Oh, that's if we had Claire. Just make sure the authorities see this. <laughs> oh, and she got it. Natalie Kensington, founder of the Kensington Corporation, was today arrested by MI6. And then she gets arrested, then that's our ending. Then there's one where they probably go kill Natalie. And then you happen. Bro, I could have <laughs> killed her! Parker! It was just business, Natalie. Oh, that ending is so fire! That 
That ending is so fire. You get to kill all of them. Oh my god. Bro, that dumb this too. Bang, right chest shot. Boom, fuck. Oh my god. <laughs> Fucking right in the dome too. Boom. Damn. Damn. And then walking out of that shit chilling too. Fuck. Then there's that ending where we die. Oh, there's that. There's an ending where I kill them and then I probably die as well. Yeah. Then there's one where I threaten to kill her. She's bleeding blood. Blah, blah, blah. So there's multiple endings where I die. Okay, so I'm not getting the only ending where I die. Wow. <laughs> there's an ending where every character, every character dies. Wait, how could you have killed both of them? You remember in the beginning where it, get, it makes us choose one? How how did this person kill both of the people? Did they just not choose? You could have probably just not chose. You run out of time, but we had streamer mode on, so we got to choose. Together Aura for the 4,200 biddies. Real for the sub. Uh, together says, hey, Joe, sorry I missed the last stream. Uh, I just now got to this one, but I'm here now. Duh! Remy for the sub and dub in the chat for Together Aura. Thank you for the 4,200 biddies, bro. Wow. All right. What do you guys want to do now? We're only three hours into stream. I'm, I'm down to do like, I'm down to do something. I'm down to do something. Y'all want to do Val? Y'all really want to do Val? All right. Do we do Toxic Val? Do we do Toxic Val? Yes or no? I'm down to do one Toxic Val game. A singular Toxic Val match where I fucking pop off. And I just ratio everybody. Oh, two, uh, one third is not voting for that. Remy for the sub. Crack a high noon? Yeah, no. Scary reacts? 